Welcome to Zero Page Homebrew, your best source for the newest Atari games. And tonight, <laughs> we're continuing. He's chewing on cables. Oh my goodness, already. Uh, we're going to continue already. He's right in on it. <laughs> it's like, um, ooh, cable chewing time. We're going to continue on with our playthrough of all the nominated games awesome. for the fourth annual Atari Homebrew Awards. And tonight, we're playing the 2600 Work in Progress games. So the originals and the ports. Nice. And this is probably the most populated field in terms of games that are being developed mm. or just games because there are so many in development. Yeah. Some games take, you know, two, three, four or five years to develop. Mm -hmm. So it's an ongoing process. So that means there's a lot in contention. So it's going to be a fun pack of games that we're going to be playing tonight. Mm -hmm. um, so thank you for tuning in. Yeah. <laughs> um, I want to thank all the uh, wonderful subscribers mm -hmm. down the side there, whose names are Alnifer, Armscar Coder, come on, up, uh, Atari 800 XL Rules, Atari 8 Bomberman, BR Polka, Buck Owens, Captain Man 2D, Charles Wheel, Chive 5, Dino Identity C, uh, Daryl 1970, Drexel, Dr. Moo Cow Z, Emu, De Emu Dan, Fox Mulder, Great Defender, Ground Troop, Rivalry, Dower Collections, Johnny WC1, Yoretto Carl G, Kev Kelly, Lauren TDZ, Mark Spacing, Mick Muse, Mike Soul, Michael, uh, Mike Littell, Miss Command, MK Smith, Mr. Zarna Woo, Mr. Fix, Money Funster, Nathan Strom, Neil Bedia, or, da or Don Ekro, Packrat, VG Kohog, R. Anschwitz, RC70, Rendered Ghost, Repentless, VG, Ricardo Pimps, S Smitty B, Socrates, Spiceware, Smear, The Dietrich, Welshman89, Tiki Dan K, TM Events, Token Muncher, Trek MD, X, Gen X. And if you want to be on that list so I can stumble over your name, mm -hmm. just click subscribe. Yeah. <laughs> or if you just want to watch, you can uh, click follow and it'll pop up and tell you when we're on, which is Tuesdays and Fridays normally. Mm -hmm. um, so we have a poll question. Mm. There are lots of options on this poll question. And I encourage you to pick more than one because you probably will have more than one answer. So to pick more than one answer, type a number. Then a space, then a number, then a space, then a number. And I Super think that's how it registers. Okay. Um, not commas like it gives in the example. Mm -hmm. I don't know why it gives an example that doesn't work. but uh, So do spaces. Uh, let me bring that up. And you guys can start voting while we go through the news. Mm -hmm. uh, there, it's going to be huge. There we go. <laughs> You don't enjoy playing. You don't enjoy playing. Oh, this is not the positive. It's no, the negative. No, it's a negative one. Usually I don't oh. do negatives, but this one I thought it'd be interesting. It'd be interesting because a lot of people don't want to admit to the negatives. Like, ah, oh, they're fine. They're yeah. fine. You know? Genre, <laughs> genres of retro games retro. you don't enjoy playing. Not modern ones. So I didn't include a lot of modern like FPSs. Okay. No 3D yep. style games. Mm. No, don't put number, number. Just put five and then space. <laughs> And then 13, then space and 13. I'm sure it still counted that, but... I'm sure it did. Don't do that. I'm sure it did, yeah. Um, it's going to hashtag. Yeah, it did count it. Um, what are you doing? Oh, this cat is in a mood. You, the dinosaur, is going to eat you. Om, 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 om. Okay. Um, <laughs> He's a mood cat. The options are... <laughs> it's crazy. Shoot 'em ups racing, action, platformer slash run and gun, simulation games slash sports. I kind of put those together. Because mm. sports are a simulation. Mm. Uh, maze games, strategy, RPGs, puzzle, fighting games slash beat em ups, because it's kind of two people or more beating each other up. Uh, rhythm games, mm -hmm. those, those do exist on retro games, uh, especially uh, homebrew. Uh, text adventure or other. And if you put other, because I try to include everything, um, just type it in the chat, because I might have missed some. The list isn't fitting on the screen. Oh, it's too big. <laughs> too many options what, there. What is it cutting Holy off? Holy smokes. Oh, oh, it is cutting off a certain 11. amount. Because normally mm. these poles aren't that big. No. I <laughs> wonder if I can kind of fix it yeah. quickly. James is going to give it a quick adjustment. Um, if he can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I can. Nice. Uh, Twitch pole. <gasps> Maybe I can can is there a filter on it no can i make it bigger no that just literally makes it bigger uh we're gonna have to i'll have to tell you uh 
<laughs> it just doesn't fit. Oh. They aren't meant to be that well, big. Well, how about you, you repeat it a little bit before the poll goes out again and yeah. then people will have another shot at it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, mine, ones I don't really enjoy very much. Yeah. Um, maze games. Oh, I wish I had the numbers. The numbers. <laughs> See, I didn't write down the numbers. Six. I don't really like maze games. Um, fighting games and beat 'em ups. Not, I, I don't, no. they're okay. No. Kittens. He's, he's out of control. Is he chewing on the bratwurst now? He might be. What are you doing? Oh beat 'em ups, gosh. fighting games. Oh. The rest of them, I don't, well, I like sport. I like simulation, some simulation, but I don't necessarily like some sports, but I do like mm -hmm. some sports. Depends on the sports. The, re the rest, I'm, I'm totally fine with. So I'm going to go 6 and 10 for mine. Mm. Um, so maybe I shouldn't have put um, simulations and sports together. Because it kind of goes against things. Yeah. Um, so let's get into the news. <laughs> he There's is a, an unhappy kitty. He, well, he was calm until the show started. And I he's know. Like, Treats! And he's like, woohoo, I'm chewing all We've the cords created now. created a monster. <laughs> um, are you a monster? So this yes, was posted a couple days ago. By a Bocianu, Bocianu, mm -hmm. something like that. <laughs> uh, it is a new sprite editor animator. I know there are a number of them, but this one looks really good. The first reasonably stable functional version of a new editor for Atari hardware sprites called Spread, Spread has just Spread. been released. Mm. The editor runs in a web browser, tests on Chrome, Firefox, and Edge. The interface. Oh, there we oh, go. Oh, oh, look, at, oh. look at him. Look at him. <laughs> it's the first time he's been on camera. When the bells oh rung. Oh my goodness. See how excited he is about that. Yeah. Oh my God. Thank Maybe you. this will calm him down. Yes, thank you, Neo Media. <laughs> ding, ding. Thank you, Neo Media. Uh, let's go to the big cat cam here. I'll talk there about go. it. You okay. saw it for a bit. Yep. Um, so, list of current features. Editing and animated tricolor sprites. Overlap. Mm. Uh, maximum sprite height of 128. Atari is trained. We're trained. Don't do tree time while holding Atari. No. Ah, ah, ah. That's how you get maimed. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I'm lucky, actually. I didn't get scratched this uh, time. Maximum number mm -hmm. of animation frames, 256. Basic editing functions. Move, horizontal, vertical flip, vertical scrolling, copy, paste, PAL, NTSC palettes, mm -hmm. pixel aspect ratio selectable. That's very cool. Uh, keyboard shortcuts. Uh, you can load in. APL and SPR uh, files and data export, of course. Uh, I, it is aimed at the Atari 8 bit, but it should be very usable for 7800 and 2600. It mm -hmm. depends on how the data exports. Um, I haven't looked into how the data exports and whether it's easily manipulable mm -hmm. into Atari 8 bit. I mean, Atari 2600 and 7800. Um, so let's take a look at the actual, um, program here. Mm -hmm. So you can see it is, uh, eight bits wide. So, you know, you can draw like that with color zero. Oh, and it shows you in single, double and quad. So that's useful for 2600 as mm. well. So let's just do that. And if you wanted, you could pretend two sprites are over top of each other. And let's do that and that's clone and then add some more and then clone again and add some more boom and then you can animate it cool that seems very I mean, that, straightforward i mean that's a terrible whatever that is mm -hmm. it's it's a nothing but <laughs> but is very straightforward um is that import moves current frame? Oh, you can move the frame there. Uh, delete. One thing it doesn't have that hopefully he'll add in is the speed of the animation. Mm -hmm. So, you know, 30 frames a second, 15, 10, 60, it'll probably allow you to so you can... understand your animation a bit better. Gotcha. It's like at a certain speed that should be showing it. Mm. Um, here, let me uh, post in, it's called spread. I'll post in the link for you guys. Uh, there you go. Uh, that's the name of it. Oh and it runs in a browser. And it looks like uh, they have supplied a bunch of 
uh, SPR files already, so you can download and take a look at some examples. Um, looks like they have a, a lever, and um, oh, this is the person who made Flob. Flob? 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 Is that the name of the game? You didn't play it. I don't think I did. Yeah, it's, it's a, very that cute, little cute though. That little, little flobby character. Flobby? Yeah. Flob. Very cute. I think. And uh, rotating wheel. It looks really good. Yeah. Uh, SPR. Sorry. SPRED. Like a spur ed. Sp sprite editor. Sprite editor. Without oh. without the A. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It it looks really 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 cool. Mm. Um, and they've made lots of updates. Um, even since then. Oh, there's an example of the output. Oh, could you please uh, add an option to use binary output for CC65 and other assemblers? Mm -hmm. So um, I think that would be very usable right there for 2600 output. Um, yeah, here we go. Cool. Added and an upcoming one. Modified it to Spriteware, uh, software sprite mode not yet available for the public. This is for yesterday. Not fully yet working, so they're going to be adding in a lot more stuff to it so it's actively being worked on uh next story ultima 5 could be coming to the atari 8-bit possibly uh this post by atlin roland um now this original post was april 18th 2021 my target is ultima 5 i was envious of the late 80s when i saw my c64 owning friends uh, i was impressed by the open world rpg approach um, when I, where I sat at home with my 800 XL without much access to software, fiddling around with some basics now decades later. So basically what this is, it reads the files from, I believe the DOS version of Ultima 5, and you can explore the world of Ultima 5 on your Atari 8-bit system. Um, so this program allows you to take those data files and, and run around the world of Ultima 5. You can't play it yet, but they are getting closer and closer to allowing you to play it. In your initial build, uh, you could explore the lands, the seas, visit the towns, the castles, and the villages. I mean, almost all the same things, but the overworld and in towns as well. Um, you're also able to rearrange your room, go eat at the taverns, mm. and play stones on the harpsichord as well. Uh, but... There was a recent update, and that's why I'm talking about this. That's a little too small. Uh, changes. Uh, and this was posted two days ago. Uh, field of view calculations. Uh, currently working fast eight-way non-recursive flood fill algorithm. So that's like looking around corners. Okay. You know, like in penult. Yes. Yeah. So you can, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They added day and night cycles, including yes. dusk and dawn phases. Uh, mostly correct light shine calculations and light sources at night. Uh, NPC schedule and pathfinding improvements. So all the NPCs move around as well. Uh, more world interactions. Ignite, view a gem, lots of bug fixes. Mm. So very, very cool. So he does not include the data files, but you can go buy them for the DOS version. Okay. And he includes instructions of how to build them together. So you can use it on your Atari 8-bit system. You do need 128K of RAM, but you can use it on an emulator cool. and, and play it. Because I don't have an 128K 8-bit system. Oh, kittens! Sucks. It's out of control. He He's is scratching. out of control. What are you doing? <laughs> don't do that. He's so crazy. So bad. What is up with you? He was crying upstairs a second ago, too. He's just crazy. <laughs> um, so, dual pokey plus YM sound. Yamaha Sound now working on Retro HQ's 7800 game drive. Okay. Um, so this was posted in the forums by Greg2600. Uh, oh, that's old. What the hell? Hmm. Right here. Uh, mm -hmm. There. Yesterday, mm. the 7800 game drive has now been shifted to a Tryon FPGA to facilitate manufacturing available of this chipset. Today, today's testing on the YM2151 and Dual Pokey Music, mm -hmm. so which is the same as the Dragonfly, has capable for two, two Pokey chips mm -hmm. plus a Yamaha chip okay. to play all together at the same time. Cool. And he posted some videos of some sounds playing. It's super quiet. Oh, I'll crank it up. 
like super quiet recording. Yeah. Oh, and then he posted this one, which from uh, the game I run. Um, and they were supplied by uh, Ivory Tower Collection. Oh, lovely. Um, and then uh, if we go to here, this is the Twitter thread, actually. The right. 7800 GD now has YM215 as well as Dual hmm. Hokey, uh, which is so, so amazing. But uh, the good stuff's in the uh, thread below. Okay. Um, Greg, uh, let's see. Du, 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 du. Um, but can it play Ricky and Vicky? A thousand dollars for a used copy is insane because yeah. that's how much they're selling for wow. on eBay. What? Not selling for, sorry, listed for. Listed for. But they're not. They're not listed for cheaper. So no. you pay that or nothing. Wow. So, um, so right here, it will do. Yes, I'll most likely get that working next week. Wow. Without audio. audio. Audio will be a little more work. Okay. So he is planning to add the audio capabilities from Ricky and Vicky, which used a like its a own chip? Like... its own unique audio chip. Wow. So support for that audio chip is a game changer because that's a really cool audio chip they wow. included. Wow. Um, because right now, if you go and buy yeah. the Steam version, yeah. which is currently like two dollars, ten dollars, it's on less. sale right now. Actually, Unless. is it? it? Yeah. You should buy it if you don't have Ricky and Vicky. Mm. And you want to play it, which is an awesome one or two player mm -hmm, game. Mm -hmm. It's on sale at Steam US and Canada for mm. like two dollars. It's super super cheap. Two dollars Canadian or two dollars US? Two twenty nine <laughs> Canadian, one ninety nine US or something Probably. like that. Yeah, fair enough. But the interesting thing about yeah. that is when you download it on street on Steam, it's actually the seventy eight hundred binary in a in a seventy eight hundred emulator wrapper. Really? So you can extract the original binary out of it. Really? But no emulator. Well, BUP system does does play that, which you can run on your computer. Oh. But with this upcoming uh, SD-based cartridge, you'll okay. be able to play it on a 7800 oh. using that ROM. So if you bought it on Steam, extracted it, then you could play it on the, on the cartridge. Yes, on the new upcoming cartridge from Saint. <laughs> yeah. So Steam, buy it now. <laughs> Steam is going to be like, why is everyone buying Ricky and Vicky all it's of a sudden? <laughs> so much. So many people. That's cool. Luckily, I do have a copy of it. So we'll be playing that for a while. Oh, yeah. Because <laughs> we yeah. do want to complete that. Mm. Okay. That's one thing in the details here. Mm. Um, hopefully the price was comparable to everything else there for the 7800. It will be cheaper than a Dragonfly. With Pokey and YM2151 modules and a full menu system. Mm. Save states as well. That's huge. Mm. Mm. So it'll have all the capabilities of a Dragonfly. Cheaper than a Dragonfly. Wow. Plus the bonus of the on-screen menus of the Concerto. Because the Dragonfly doesn't have on-screen menus. Oh, that's Plus right. it'll have save states. Wow. Which is... The best of all worlds, plus more. Nice. It's crazy, crazy, crazy. Wow, that's yeah, cool. save states is huge. That means you can save something, go do something else, yeah, yeah, come yeah. back, or cheat. Yeah. That's or the other cheat. Thing. <laughs> or cheat. <laughs> um, save states too. Yeah. So super, super awesome. Wow. So I was chatting with Saint uh, okay. yesterday about this, and we may have something cool oh. for when it gets released. Oh, so nice. keep keep watching. Nice, 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 um, nice, nice. But he says it won't be done for a while. Okay. It, it's a it's, big it's project. It's an in progress yes. thing. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's in progress, so it'll be a while before something special might happen on ZPH. But we'll okay. see. All right. We'll see about That's that. That's exciting. I yeah, like yeah. That. Mm -hmm. um, so let's get to the game. Yay! Because we have a lot to play. Do we? Is Lots it a four hour? Games. Someone, someone no, no, commented, no, no, no. oh, is this going to be four hours? Uh, it's mm. probably two, but maybe three. Yeah. Maybe three. Neo like, Media just said find Easter eggs, maybe. Uh, for when? For what? <laughs> In what? For your special thing. I don't know. Oh, they, yeah. Easter eggs. Yeah. No, no, no. It's much cooler. And than then that. I saw Easter eggs and it's I much immediately thought, that. oh, chocolate. I chocolate. want chocolate so bad. Which I, need my list. I want a gigantic bowl of mini eggs. Oh, mini eggs. Mini eggs. Yeah. 
I'm very tired. I did not sleep well last night. So what? I'm trying to keep I my energy okay. up. I'm not sure the wine is going to help me at all. Usually when you um, don't sleep well, I don't sleep well. Really? And then we debate who kept each other up. Uh, yeah, no, I just um, didn't sleep well. My, I but I slept okay. Up. Yeah. So I know I didn't keep you up. No, 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 you and didn't And you didn't keep me keep up. Me up. I just kept waking you up. You just kept yourself My up. My brain was just, sometimes you're processing and you just keep waking up in the middle of the night. So you might have to poke me, keep me awake. So, oh. um, or I my need harmony. I need chocolate. You have lots of chocolate upstairs. I know. I'm, I might have to run upstairs and get chocolate. My Harmony Encore uh, mm. broke yesterday. <gasps> what? Because I turned it off in the middle of loading a game. Oh. But luckily, Batari build something in that you can refresh your harmony encore hook it up to the usb mm. reinstall what, with the software or whatever yeah. the bios oh. <laughs> you can see on there that's not normally there oh. i had to reinstall the bios and oh, it's no. back to life well that's good that's yeah good. it's very very good it's, i was like does it have a hard reset function like a phone kind, kind of <laughs> kind of does you, you do have to beginning. do a, it's a bit more than a button, but it's easier. RC70 enough. says that can break the harmony. <laughs> uh, yeah, don't don't turn off your harmony Ooh. in the middle of loading. Don't do it. It's oh. it's repairable, but it's a pain in the ass. Yeah, S. Ramirez says they've had to reflash their encore as well. Yeah, yeah, I've had to do it before as well. Yeah, and but this time it it was like giving me trouble reflashing it, so mm -hmm. I had to use a different USB port. And, oh, I see. But if you do that to yours, it's possible to get it back. Mm -hmm. Okay, so go to today's date. What is today's date? <sighs> the newest date on there i make it i don't easy. know <laughs> <laughs> i'm tired <laughs> so we're gonna do original games first okay uh Ooh. so it's canonica first a 16k game from vhzc vladimir right. zuniga all right kitten you can't be there <laughs> the cat is is on top of the uh, uh he's the mixer or whatever it is over the there. Amplifier. The amplifier. Yeah. The amplifier. One what, the other day he was on there for like a half an hour and now he thinks it's his home. Oh yeah, because it's warm too, right? Oh, it's the warmest thing in the room. So another great uh shooter from VHZC. Oh gosh. Um Where you're at the bottom, shooting things, going across the screen, coming down on the screen. Awesome fonts, shows you your lives or your your amount of times you need, you're able to get hit. Um, there's a timer as well. Awesome pseudo pseudo three D wireframe shapes in this. Like yeah, what he's able to do on a twenty six hundred and seventy eight hundred is absolutely unbelievable. Need a collar cam for Atari. Oh my goodness. That would be interesting. Yeah. Um wonder how small of one you could get that has um wireless video. Like real time wireless video. Because there's ones that record. There's tons of those. Oh, that's true. Because they put you put them on your cat and you let them outdoors and they roam around and then you get it back and you go, Oh, where'd my cat go? And it does GPS. Pang. Oh, it is Pang. Yep. Super fun. And the skulls. Of course. He loves... Whoa! Skulls that turn into meteors. Yeah. Awesome sprites. Exactly Neo Media. He is... King he's, of sprites. He's king of sprites. Yeah. He is, he's good at everything. He makes his own box art. Oh, yeah. He does absolutely start to finish everything on his game. The sounds, the graphics, the box art, the manual... Um, the programming, everything. He is a one-man machine and does about 10 games a year. I swear he starts on 10 games a year. Sometimes nothing beats a straightforward yeah, shooter. Ah! Ah! Oh, this one's... Ah! Oh, you're not doing like... well on this one. It's because these have very wide bounces. That's why. I have trouble on this, too. It's like, it's not where you think it's going to be. And they're big. Ah, oh, that murdered me. My turn. Dissect a Stop getting hit by them balls. Oh, that's a good hint. It's a good <laughs> Thanks, hint. Thanks, Carl G. It's a very good hint from Carl G. My turn, because I can't not play a oh, shooter. Oh, it's so good. That's a good game. Yeah. Pew, pew, 
Pew pew pew! Nostalgic pew, says. Pew, 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 pew. That's great. It is. The cannon's awesome. In the 7800 version, he has a little wheel on the cannon, I think, that spins around as in, as you move. I love those Carl G. Pro tips, yeah. <laughs> super pro tip from Carl G. Pro. <laughs> it should just pop up on the screen. Carl G. Super pro tip. <laughs> Yeah. Stop getting hit by the ball. <laughs> <laughs> Avoid enemies to save lives. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> that's the best. That's the best description of how to play a game. Stay alive longer for higher score. <laughs> yes. uh, I, I, uh, yeah, that would make a great keychain. Actually, <laughs> gonna have to print that on a keychain. Yeah. Neomedia Neo Media says, wait, there's a 7800 version of this? I, yeah, yeah, I, I, yeah, there is. It's fairly new. Yes, yeah. Yeah. I didn't, something weird happened when I did this level. Which one, this one? I thought the one before. Oh, the triple level. Oh. oh. No, wait, have you? It's the first time I've encountered this. Is it? Yeah. It, like, skipped it. I oh. only I only shot something once and then it ended. And you got that a bonus or a power up or you found a uh, yes. found a special little part. Mm -hmm. It is you canonical. You have yep. to review the footage. No, it it, it yeah, went it even... went orange and then I just skipped the next battle. Yeah, I didn't even notice you even play that. I like level. hit it right away. That was very strange. Yeah. Bug. Is that, is that the... Yeah. Yeah, that's... He's renamed it, I guess. Yeah. Mm. Canonica. It is Canonica, though, isn't it? Um, Pretty much, yes. Yeah. That's that's why I think people are a bit mm. confused. And me too. Yep. Well, something about... Yeah, go the opposite direction from Yeah, from you one. do, you do. It's Do true. not get trapped. You can't, you can't, you can't really out... No, 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 you cannot. Oh. Oh my goodness, those are terrifying. Oh my god. Terrifying! They are. They come right down randomly. Oh my goodness. So you don't know where they're going to be. And it's very dangerous to get underneath them. Yeah, they move fast. You have, they have to fall directly down. That's my first life in that one. Oh, what's mm. next? Triple. What? Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, they're cool. I love the um, meteorite uh, skulls and... Yeah. Well, Pretty much clear up meteorites. Path. Arena foot. Hey, Arena foot. Glad you can join yeah. tonight. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna hold down the button for that this level. Yep, that's a good tactic for that level. Mm -hmm. ooh, 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 shooting. Light bulbs. Shooting light bulbs. Oh, the scores are very low in this game. <laughs> They're like super. Mm -hmm. Oh, bats! I don't think I've ever made it to the mm -hmm. bats. I haven't seen these guys before. No. Doing pretty good. We have played this on the show. Obviously, we play all the VHZC mm -hmm. games on the show. They're all amazing. Oh, oh yeah. Splendid nut pack a bell cannon indeed. <laughs> yes, that's that's yeah. the that's the pun he's going for. Shoot. And go get them. Go. Wow. I'm doing well, I think. Ah! Ah! Oh, he, he's mean. He starts right where, where you. I don't think he's included any right bosses in this. They're all just oh, that's levels. So cute. That one's a cool one. This kind one's of a awesome. squiddy. It is kind guy. of squiddy. Not squiddy. Um, jellyfishy. Oh, jellyfishy. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. 
Oh, here's a boss. Oh, I swear I made it to this. He loves his skulls. Oh, Jesus. But it does turn red before it gets mad, so you're able to... Kind of prepare yourself. Ah, he smooshed you. He should chew on you, I think, if you fall down. Yeah, that would be good. What is the, uh, who's, who's, who's the punk band I'm thinking misfits. of? The Misfits, thank you. Oh, I got him. Just took two lives. I knew you would know. I knew you would know. James is a punk fan. Uh, I'm, yeah, I'm not no, anywhere near were. an expert. No, but, uh... Yeah, I like punk music. Also avoid the big skulls, that's <laughs> Carl G. Yes. Thank yep. you, Carl G. <laughs> it's a great tip. It's a great tip. Uh, the number of different patterns he has in this game is it, it incredible. It is amazing. Like, yeah. even in this level, they come down straight first, and yes. then they start bouncing. It's just those tiny little touches. Oh, yeah. It does look like a birdie still in its egg. It has that oh, kind of look yes. with its wings sticking out the side like a Looney Tunes bird or something. Yeah. Yep. Oh god. It should chew the cannon oh like a god. slim jim. Yeah. Oh my, oh my god. gosh. Oh. My oh, it's god. like kind of random. Oh, oh my, my goodness. Gosh. Ah. It pauses and then goes down. And it can pause at your level. So super deadly. Very deadly. Oh my god. Oh boy. Ooh. Wow. That's a crazy level. That's the craziest so far. <laughs> oh, oh god, no, oh. no. Oh god. <laughs> How am I supposed to get this? Just hold it down. There, yeah, get on the edge. Right. I'm timing. There we go. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Damn it. You have to get out of the way and then move back into its orbit, yeah. I think. Oh, <laughs> wow. Uh, oh, oh. oh, that is so dangerous. That... Go VHZC. Wow, this is a unique pattern of Whoa. movement. Oh. oh my goodness. And it's moving in a circle. You don't see circles in... Uh, oh, you're back. You looped. I looped it. Oh, I no, won it... the game. Oh, they, 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 jump, they jump forward now. Oh, no, it's ah, a little different. Nice. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's much harder. <laughs> I just don't know when they're gonna jump forward i think you do have to kill a certain number of them in the time because you do finish a level mm. I think. Oh, no, I it's in the hallway he's not chewing on cords so it's like round oh my god <gasps> it was like a skull that started doing circles <laughs> wow VHZC should be a category in the poll. Yes. No, who would say they don't like VHZC? That's right. No. <laughs> Bam. <laughs> wow. So I didn't even come close to finishing. Because that was all new. That, that yeah, last it was. little creature, whatever That's it was, crazy. that killed me instantly. There's definitely more going on there. Okay. Should have done a save state. <laughs> That's okay. I wonder if it'll play 2600 okay. games. Oh, the, new... the cart? Yeah, because the 7800. Can play them? Can play 2600 mm. games. Then you'd have save states? Mm. On the 2600. Ooh, that would be so good. So good. Okay. Are these work in progresses or these are completed? These games? are work in progress. Okay. They're not done yet. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So there's still. I missed that when you were, yeah, when you were is, talking. Yeah. VHZC games always look pretty close to done when he when he first puts, puts know. them out. <laughs> yeah. He he does so much. And then and then he updates them and completes them and then whole levels have changed. And that's the other thing I've noticed too. Sometimes you're like, whoa, there's like Yeah, so we're gonna look at the poll now because it's going to disappear. Okay. Um to remind people of the options. Yeah. All right. Well no to finish it. Well to finish it, but also the options. Yeah. Oh, is it done? Uh no, but it's going to disappear okay. eventually. So let me just bring it up. If anybody wants to vote just before it finishes, the list right now is simulation games and sports in number one. So I don't know if they hate simulation games or sports, but one or the other. Sports. Yeah. I'm not usually on the sports and side. And in second that. place, yeah. fighting games and beat-em-ups. Okay. I find them really, really boring. That was one of my choices, <laughs> where it's just kick, 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 punch, punch, throw. Yeah. Next guy, kick, 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 punch, punch, throw. Oh, that was hate. Yes, it's hate. Sorry. Yes. So somebody 
pick their favorite. Yeah, <laughs> I voted wrong in RC70. Yeah, it's okay. You yeah. can vote wrong. Um, I dislike both of those those top categories. Uh, sports games, not my Depends favorite. Depends on the sports. If it's more of a arcadey fun. I mean, I enjoyed what was it we played um, the the soccer game where. Yeah, you're... yeah, exactly. Those type of games. I'm thinking. I don't. I don't dislike them when they're like two player multiplayer games as much, but, but they're, they're not like my favorite. Accurate full length. You have all the options. That's a bit tedious. I well, find. Well, and and neither of us are huge sports fans, yeah. so I don't think that appeal is there. So uh, fighting games. I'm 100. percent I'm not really into the fighting games. Getting. No, no, no. Come on. He's so bad. Um, in uh, bad third cat. place, Rhythm. Golf. I mean, I, yeah. I only play them once in a while, Rhythm, but I don't mind them if they're a little oh, bit fun. You know, a, like... It's adju adjusting up and down now. <laughs> oh, people are voting. Yeah. Yep. Rhythm. Minus one for five. I don't know if it works that way. <laughs> um, and surprise... Uh, text mm. Adventures. I, I, I mean, I don't go to them first, but I do find no. them fun. They were fun back in the day. Yep, yep. And yeah, I have to write down a lot of stuff for text adventures. And, you know, it's kind yeah. of fun. Make maps. Yeah, you know. the map part, yeah. Good beat-em-ups exist. I'm not... Beat-em-ups? Yeah, like, like Double Dragon. Like you go through levels and you have to fight that Here's another that wave opponent. of three people come Here's, in. Punch, oh, punch, those punch. those beat-em-ups. Throw, yeah. get a bat, I, I always think of, like, them. I don't know what they're called, but the fighting games where it's, like, you and an opponent, well, opponent, and you fight, and then you That's move Street on. Fighter, 1v1. Yeah. It's 1v1. Like, usually is static that, is screen. Is that a fighting game? That's what I would okay. say, fighting game. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Two people hey. on the screen. Hey. We just replaced that cable cat. We did. I'm not joking. He he destroyed the last one. cable. I'm coming to get you. <laughs> okay. So let's move on. All the rest are pretty much the Good same, cats. I think, here. Let's see. Uh, tied for the fourth. Shoot 'em ups, racing, action. Maze game, strategy, all the rest are about the same. RPGs, yeah. Nobody typed others, so I, I got all the uh, categories. The main categories. I love yeah. RPGs, so that would definitely. Streets and of Rage, Final games. Fight. Yeah. Yeah, I, they're okay. Yeah. I just don't enjoy them. Other people <laughs> do, and that's good. Yeah. Nothing wrong with it. It's just people like different uh, styles of games. Uh, by the way, my Hercules cable has shipped. Awesome. Glad yeah. I was able to uh, recommend that. It looks really good. I think you'd be really happy with it. All the jail bars went away. That was the cable that I got last show. Oh, yes. I plugged yes. it in. It's awesome. Beautiful, pristine, perfect. Because it used to have like faint vertical lines. <laughs> He's crazy. He's crazy. He's crying and running around right now. <laughs> used to have faint vertical lines, and those are called jail bars. Jail bars, yeah. All yeah. gone. Nice. It's super, super clean. Come on. Okay, Come on. so let's load up what? the next game. Why are you crying? Oh my goodness. He's out of control. He is out of control. So, if you want to go to the next game. It is Cone Ball by original Kevin stuff? Kelly. Original? Yep. Yeah. yeah, we have lots We've of only done one. <laughs> Just it's going to take a long time. It's okay, it's Friday. I love it. Well, to play two player. I did open any bottle of wine, so... <laughs> We're all good for the yeah. night. Okay, you can play two-player, please. Two? Okay. Uh, we'll do straight shooting. I... Uh, did you play this? Yes. I think you beat me player at it. Player draw. Oh, no, we're going to play. We don't want to make a field. Uh, what color do I want? I think light. That's very contrasty. A lot of different blue colors you could choose from. Oh, and a purple. Ooh, purple. And some purple. Bring on the purple. Okay, so I'm on the left. How does this work again? Uh, let's see. Oh, that. Oh, okay. Oh, wait. <laughs> oh, oh, yes. Right. I have to what? push back your walls. Oh, I don't. And you have your own ball. Wait, what am I? Oh, the walls. Okay. Yep. Ah, ah, that's right. And the, your green thing. Oh, oh my God. I have to avoid the purple thing. It's a crazy game. It's weird, and it's fun. Yep. Ah, oh, I got hit. The work, uh, work in progress category is very tough. Oh! Because there's so many great games. Oh my goodness, I didn't get it. Ah! This one is frantic. It is. Because there's so many things going on on the screen, and there's a lot of deadly things happening on the screen. 
Oh, oh but your ball hit. Your ball killed me. Yeah. Ugh. Ugh. Because you recall your ball. Yeah. I need to, like, recall my ball. You, 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 I can't ah, remember how you do it. You hold the button. Hold it. There you go. Ah. But you can only hold it when you have the... Yeah. Oh, I keep missing. Why isn't it pushing back to your thing? I think I'm too close. And you've almost got one. No! <laughs> oh, you stole it right before I got it. A unique sport, but still a sport. Uh, yeah, this... It is. This is, is definitely sports-ish. Why isn't it working? How do you do it? <laughs> How are you doing it? What do you mean? I can't push back. You, you grab it and hold. Let me try. I have moved one. Okay, go ahead, go ahead. Grab oh, it. Oh, I think player two you... is at a disadvantage. Oh, we figured this out before, didn't we? Yeah. You kept beating me and I was getting real pissed off. There we go. Yeah. Oh, it's because I think you're holding a button and I can't do it or something? Yeah, something like that. Yeah, he's fixed it since then. Now it's working. Because there is a button priority issue, something like that. Oh, come on. Oh, oh that's not working again. Oh, there we go. There you go. Where, where am I? And then you disappear for a while too, which I find kind of funny. <laughs> no, but sometimes you come back immediately, and sometimes it takes a while, I find. Yeah, you're back right away that time. You can steal the ball. Yeah, you can. Ah. It is a weird game. <laughs> it's it a is. weird sports game. Ah. There we go. I love how you just disintegrate. <laughs> I don't know how to steal it, though. Do you hold it or yeah, you just run, in, run into the... Okay. Hold the button and run into it. Oh, what is happening? Things are out of control. Oh, because my ball is stuck? Is that why it's going crazy? Yep. Ah. Why didn't that work? It's, I think that's the other thing we notice sometimes. It doesn't always... Um... Oh, we got one. Cat! Cat! Going for a big comeback here. Oh. Oh, didn't get it again. One more to go. Ah! Oh, dead. Yeah, you got it. Go ahead. Take it. <laughs> Take it. Oh, can't get too close to yours. One more push. There we go. Player two wins! Yay! Woo! Crazy cat! Woo! Tar's taking advantage of both James and Tanya being occupied. <laughs> he is. Yeah. Naughty cat. So that's a super fun one or two player game mm -hmm. um, with an interesting twist on the handball type of situation type of game. Let's go to the next one. Which is, I might as well just stay on that screen. Uh, Dragon Defense 2021 by Tyler Frisbee. You'll have to rename that because it's still a work in progress. labeled demo oh yes i remember this game have you did you play yeah you played this one this is crazy game see if we remember all the rules oh i do yeah there's things flying at you yeah and you're oh you have to get the you have to there's defenses you have to defend your uh castle from being oh you have to have pick to block up things those. You have to pick up things. And I figured out like a super, super crazy strategy that like wins it worked every really time. well. Yeah. <laughs> the trees I can't fly remember. Off the screen. Great oh, yeah. graphics. You have to pick up things to be able to shoot. Oh, in the to first do play. different magic. And there's. You can shoot or you can. No. no. I can't remember. Uh, 
can't remember. The author says it's based on a real game as child children invented. Yes, yes. I mean, the graphics are amazing. Yeah. This graphics is a 32K are... game. Beautiful, yeah. But I was like... Remember, you have to... I was exploiting there. something and I can't... Oh, the, I think those are bullets. Yeah, some of them are. You can't touch the trees. The trees are alive. Damn it. Oh, you can rebuild your wall. That's what it was, too. So make sure you rebuild your wall. I don't know how to do that. How do you rebuild the wall? I can't remember. <laughs> I don't remember either. <laughs> I don't remember any of the rules. Oh, goodness. There's something to do with trees. You have to shoot those guys at the bottom, too. I know. I can't remember. <laughs> do you remember? Let me try. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to refresh my wine. Oh, okay. I die fast. Okay, you die with the trees. Shoot. Shoot the dragons. I think you need the bullets. Let me not get that thing. I can still shoot. I think you shoot these little guys down here for something. Oh, yeah. Okay, that's what I was exploiting before. You shoot the guys at the bottom and you get life back. There's another dude. Oh, I stumbled. shoot the trees too no you can't but i remember you shoot <laughs> the, the guys at the bottom yes but i get a heart because you lose part of your wall but you don't you have to have enough there you go oh but oh you have to you have to rush and move right is that how you shoot yeah i wasn't always sh i wasn't always shooting watch the cat uh, kitten he's um settling on your pile of papers over there that's not good no? Is it an important pile of papers? Very important. Kittens! Oh my goodness. It's a bad cat. Pretty hyper trees. Pretty hyper trees. <laughs> yeah, the trees are jumping around, being happy. Wow. It's beautiful. I, it is. I, I, uh, I, I the do colors. think everything is just gorgeous in this game. Heart didn't give me anything. Uh, does it give you an extra life if you've been hit? Because you haven't been hit yet. Oh, ah! oh, oh, my God, oh the tree. those trees really the trees get Trees attacked me. Is it time to give Atari catnip to slow him down? No, it does We've not. We've never given him catnip on the show. No. We'll do that later. He does get really, really mellow. Yeah, we should do that. For a treat. Yes. The next treat time. The next treat bell will bring down some catnip. We'll give him a few treats too because he does need to ring the bell. But um, we'll give him some catnip at the end. That didn't do anything. Didn't rebuild the wall. No. Didn't give me. I can't remember the wall. Zip. Nip time, yeah. Nip time. You can, but I can't remember how you do that. I can't remember either. Can't shoot the trees. <laughs> Anybody remember how to build the wall? I think that's the white, the white ones or something allow you to rebuild it, but I can't remember. I think maybe you have to just oh, build up remember. your bottom right thing just watch yeah see it's building and then, up and then you can then you can build it rebuild it but how is it a double joystick game no 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 spell which rebuilds any damage caused to the castle wall by moving the joystick down while pressing the fire button down and far about. Oh, okay. But, but you, you need, need eight. Yeah. Oh, okay. okay. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you, B.R. Pocock. <laughs> yeah. And I'm trying to remember because it was a little while since we yeah. played it. I think I need a bit more. I think you can do it now. Down? No. Maybe Down. you don't have enough yet. Not quite there. No. You have to be in a certain spot? No. Yeah, I think you just just down and... Shoot. No. no. Shoot. No. That didn't shoot them. Oh, it's it went going, through it's them. It's going through their necks. Oh. That's <laughs> <laughs> what happens when you have uh, hardware collision and you have uh, holes in people's necks. <laughs> it requires a certain amount of mana. Yeah, so you have to have enough mana. You have to pick up enough of those things, I think. Oh, I picked up so many. I don't know. I don't know, baby. <laughs> yeah. Look. So many. There's no indicator. Lots. Now down. Nope. Okay. That's okay. 
that's it, okay. It is a cool game. Yeah. I can't remember it's all the beautiful. rules. Beautiful it looks game. awesome. It's got some good sounds. Mm. I'll leave it to an exercise for the player mm -hmm. to figure it out. Okay. Unfortunately, we don't have the instructions next to us like we no. usually do. So, but uh, I think that shows off how beautiful that game that game yeah. is. It's, and it is a fun game. Oh, I like this game. So go look back at the last time we played it. Yeah. Immunity. Yes. yes. Very fitting. And for those who were in the chat earlier talking about getting over COVID, I wish you um, well, the best. Yeah. Yes, and and a, a, a very fast recovery as well. Yeah, it does have great music. Yeah. It is true. So, in this one, oh, you have to go eat things. Where, where am I? You're Something at the top. Weird. You have to go press up. No, that one's already... Oh. But I can't get it. You, you were getting it, but you didn't uh, finish getting it. But how do I get it? How yeah. do I get it? You're not telling me how to get it. There. Now you press the button. And then what? There we go. Just Thank you. Thank you. That's all I wanted to because know. Because you're yellow, it's yellow, the background's yellow. Or you're gray. It's all yeah. very non No, no, no. Color. I just couldn't remember what I was supposed to do to actually get rid of it in the end. Because it went back. It, like, didn't, didn't do the thing. Look so, these, the these uh, top left number is your health. And you don't want that dipping down. It's quite a complex game. Oh, now you'll be able to see things better. And I think in the newer versions, he's fixed some of the colors so they're not so crazy. Mm -hmm. And he's added in... Um, oh, I hate that. Yeah, if you miss them, you have to wait for your bullet to go off the screen. Like, oh, so many old school games. Oh, Ugh. you've got one attached to you. You don't want them to attach to your oh cell wall. Oh my god, it like... And it is very original, you're correct, Carl. This is such a unique concept, and it's got dual screens as well. It's does not it have just the dual screen? screen? Okay, I'll I don't let know it if go this to version, that. Oh. I don't know if this version does. It's an earlier version. Oh, there it is. Oh, there you go. Yep, so this version does. You have to eat all those things, and you have to get that other... You have to get the E's as well, and bounce them into your side. Ribosomes, thing. yeah. Yeah, you, Nom nom. Eat those RNAs. Eat the RNAs. Oh, the viral RNAs are attacking. Yeah, they've got two. And they're building. They're building more. They're building more. Ah, take them out. Oh, you missed it. Oh, I... Oh, I won't let you get it no, from there. I can't go up that high. And it teaches you science. They could, they could, you could play this game in a classroom, Ugh. and teach the kids about uh, DNA replication. Yes, pretty much. Come or on. viral depli or viral replication. All these ROMs are 2021, and not most current. Yeah, some of them aren't. But you have to judge the 2021, because that's when the contest ended, or the event, uh, contest. Sure. And you definitely recognize those as viral cells. Mm -hmm. Yep, we've been showing it on the news for two years. Yeah. <laughs> and the ball with the red spikes on the outside. There aren't many video games that include RNA. Yes. Probably one. This one. This one. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if there's any any other ones. That'd be interesting. Yeah. Yellow is hard to see against the background. Yeah. It can I, be. Yeah. I think he is updating it or plans to update it so that the colors are a bit better but he he had very specific colors for very specific parts of the body um but he can still like everything inside is all like pink and red anyway and so he can make, pick any color he wants it doesn't have to be as realistic it just needs to uh, be able to be able to be seen you have 23 heart you're dying. The oh, body's no. dying. Oh no. Quick, shoot, shoot the viruses. It's gonna get me. Oh, oh no. It's attaching to your cell wall. Ugh. Seven, seven, zero, flat line. You're dying. Yeah. <laughs> game over. Speaking. Great game over score. Yes, yes. 
Awesome stuff. I love it. We're blazing through <laughs> these. All right. Oh, Mike Soul's here. Hey, Mike Soul. Uh, I did fix stuck at the top issue. I did adjust the color some. I need to test on different hardware. Yeah. Ah, very cool. Robot Zed. Robot Zed. So this is a Mega Man type a game where you mm -hmm. traverse a maze. Um, this is going to crash, actually. Is Didn't it? think about this. It may or may not crash. Okay. <laughs> because this does not work on my combination of Harmony and mm. my modded RGB. I probably still have it on the Uno if it crashes. So mm. Go for it. Flash, it. flashy. Working so far. Oh, this we'll game. Is It'll probably blink out of existence in a second. Stop it. He's crazy. So you have different bullets, and you can absorb uh, the what other... What am I supposed to do? Just get out of there. Oh, uh, of do there. I shoot? No. You can. Can I jump on them? Uh, down, down is shoot. Up is shoot. Up is shoot. There we go. That's what I was looking and for. And down is to change your weapon. But you don't have any weapons, because you haven't shot anybody. And collected their stuff. Thank you for posting that, Arena Foot. So this guy will have something that you can collect. Most likely. And it'll just automatically be absorbed by yourself. Okay, that is... Maybe not. Now you have another power. So you have his power, so if you press down on the button, you can change. And you can test it out. You're safe there. Cute little creatures. Best time is to go right after he shoots. You can duck. Oh. And you have um, power-ups. So your health is on the left, which is five. And your power for your weapon. Right now you're just using your pea shooter. But you have ten for your special weapons. So if you... So that gives you more power for your weapons. So you go to the yellow one, mm -hmm. it's the bounce, dropping bounce things. Mm -hmm. But you're using up your weapons, so change back to your pea shooter. Unless you absolutely want to. Ah! One. Ah! <laughs> Yo, lose. Mm -hmm. Sure. I know you like this game. Very cool explosions. It Music's is. great, too. I love games with them. Um, just. Yeah, great music. Just background music going on. It's not too in your face, the music. It's like... and I've got ten. Mm. A little bit of a glitch there. Transport effect at the beginning. Yep. So his shot that you absorb, I think, is just a more powerful shot. Yes. So, yeah. so let's go back to the pea shooter. So that's mm -hmm. a safe spot there. I think I can shoot. No, I think you have to duck. He was hitting me, but maybe I wasn't all the way across. Maybe. To hit up. Yeah, shoot him. There you go. Good job. 20. Lots of power. Let's go to the red. So cute. Oh, ran away. No! Oh, I can jump from here. There we go. Gave me nothing. Okay, so that's actually a good weapon, that one. Because mm. it goes through walls. Mm. But you have to get there to shoot him. Mm. I, I can make it there. No, I don't think you can. You have to just jump from the far end. Am I in danger here? Am I in danger? No. I think I'm in danger here. No, I don't think you are if you're no? on that far edge, yeah. Okay. You just jump. And you just shoot straight down. There we go. Woo! So now I've got his power. So you do this. You go watch. Nice. So it goes through walls, which is nice. super good. Ah! This one's really tough. Mm -hmm. You have to almost get past him, I don't know. Yeah. <gasps> oh. Slippery. Move fast. Mm -hmm. ah! ah! So slippery. <laughs> there we go. So this is a good one for... 
Him. Him. Let's just use his own weapon against him. Ah! Yeah. Nice. Switch back to the pea shooter. Ooh, now this one's good for the one that goes through walls. Purple. I think it's the other purple. Oh, no, you're right. Right? Oh, look at that big... Health. <gasps> Yay! Yay! This game's so good. <laughs> it's been a long time in progress. Yeah. This one. Oh, so much health. Let's see if I can make it to the boss. Come on. Did I kill him? No. Ah! Ah! Oh, his bullet goes forever. I had a lot of health. Great character sprites. Yes. Great power ups. Yes. Ooh, where does this bullet go to? Not good. Can I go past? Down. You can go past him, I think. Yep. See, it doesn't get you on that, that top step. Perfect. So jump after he shoots. There you go. Nice. Good job. And use the purple. Ooh, oh my god, I have so oh, much health. Oh, good job. This is going to be so good when I get to the boss. Unless you the demo does... It's amazing how much strategy strategy exists in that game. Yeah. yeah. Unless the boss isn't in this Carl demo. Carl G, you don't have to kill every enemy. You don't, but yeah. you get Carl G's words of wisdom. <laughs> if they're if they're difficult to shoot, I'll bypass them. Yeah. But you get... Look how much health I have. Oh, tons. Yeah, so you it's do worth get a it, lot. It's worth it to yeah. sometimes... Oh, God. Depends if you're trying to get to the See, end of the level health. fast, or you're just enjoying yeah. shooting all the enemies. And it's and it's random because it'll randomize who is yeah. on which kind of look to a level. Mm. Uh -oh. Can you tell I like this game? Oh boy. James likes this game. Run! Can I get safe there? Oh, ah, forget it. <laughs> Too late. This guy's easier to kill. Ah. There we go. Lots of power. Ooh, boy. Run. Oh, I'm safe here. Oh, I'm not. Nope. You can, oh, maybe you can get to the top, but I don't know. Nice. Oh, nothing. nothing. Oh, what a waste. Oh! Ah! Get, get on the step. And it has a health bar for the enemies, oh, too. Yes, it does, which, which is, is great. so good. It's so nice to see how much more you need to get them. Huge it's power. It's those blue ones tend to give you the health. Nice. Yep. 46. <gasps> it's the boss. Perfect timing. Get that oh, boss. Oh, my God. I'm going to switch to my power. Oh, God. Not that one. Under. Run away. Run away. Ah. Well, you need lots of health. Ah, get under him. He, I love that he has great eyebrows, the, the boss. He does. And makes this, ah. like, mischievous face when he when he gets close. Look at that. 22 he and 9. Look, yep, his, his, that's my bullet, I think. Is it yours? I thought it was his. That's so funny. Now, this game, the full game, has, like, six different... Levels? levels? Yes. Yeah. So, I think it's go to? Yes. Robot City, Junkyard, Seaway, sea, uh, Sandland. We're playing a bunch. Of, uh, did we try them all Lava out? Land, I think Mind so. Zone. We did yeah. get to all of them. We, we showed them all off. Some of them are just brutally deadly. Yes. So let's just pick one and die because we're sure. going to. Go to Lava Land. Oh, Avalanche. this is the demo you can't. Oh, it's just Only the ice zone. zone. Okay, fair enough. I think. Yeah, yeah I think you're right. Because I think I have the full version. Yes. But yes, yes, yes. that's not what we're, that's not what we're playing. <laughs> I loved how the boss walked in like, oh, oh my dear. dear. <laughs> yeah, just limited to the ice zone, which is yeah. plenty to die. In. Ninja Turtle! <laughs> this one's slippery. Constantly slipping. He's constantly like flailing around. I love yeah. it. It's so cute. Yes. Yeah, Iceland's not too bad. Oh god. I think I need my. Pink? It's the other pink, I think. Purple. Oh, 
without it. Oh, maybe you don't. Oh, green? you start over. Oh. What's green? I don't know. What the hell is that? Oh. Oh. Boomerang. Nice. Well, I got him anyway. That was good. Uh. Oh. I'm gonna just go back to normal pea shooter. <laughs> Mike Stoll says, haha, yes, amazing how a couple of pixels can make that emotional impression. Yeah. Yes. He just has that. <laughs> ah! <laughs> ah, so slippery. And he has eyebrows, too. I, I, I'm I, always impressed with uh, sprites with eye one eyebrows. One pixel eyebrows. I know! <laughs> like angry, angry eyebrows. It's great. Ooh, I need that. I need that power. Ooh, it's a deadly, deadly trap, though. Give a... I have nothing to drop down. If He's you get close one. to him... Right? Oh, yep. Right next to him. Oh yeah, that's good. Let's slip all the way. Yes! That's the power I needed. Now I can get those bats. Ooh. <laughs> mm, ugh. Maybe I can shoot him from here? Nope, can't get back up! Oh well. So much for that dude. Shoot him and he can't shoot me. You can drop the yellow one. Oh, I can. Uh... Oh, oh they probably have doesn't to go stand through walls. Yeah. yeah, got him. Oh, I got nothing back. Boo. But <laughs> that's the chance you take. I love his endless flailing on the ice, it's so amazing. This game's been in work in progress for years. Yeah? Four years? years. Really? Yep. Oh. But you can That's see great. how big it is. Yes. He does have all the worlds done. Nice. So I think it's on the precipice of being done. <laughs> <laughs> how can this be the hardest thing to do? Oh my gosh. Have some yellow. Oh god. Didn't have time to change weapons. Should have changed beforehand. To the pea shooter. Mm -hmm. It's just wasting. Come back in here. Give me some energy. Mm. Nothing! Nice. Pea shooter. I love this game, Neo Media says. Each, oh, each yeah. level has its oh. own music. What? Ooh, I want He's this. floating in midair. I want that power. That's floating the, in midair. Oh, don't give me his power. Oh my god. Ooh, actually, I still need the yellow. Dropping. That's a dropping one. Yeah, might work. Yeah. The bats are dead. They fly through walls. He says, he says it's so Mega Man-ish. Really it cool. It is. Yes. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> is it boss time? Nope. Ah! Get close. Duck. Ah! <laughs> Sorry, I'm playing this so long in comparison to other games, but I love it. <laughs> we'll be playing all night. That's all good. That's all good. Oof. Oh, it runs out! <laughs> boss time? Ooh, it is bossies. boss time. Oh, got to change oh, to my weapon. I love weapon. that face. My weapon. Ah! Oh. oh, this weapon sucks. Ah! And there's things falling from the ceiling. Oh, I'm gonna die. And a monster. Can you pea shoot? Oh, he's almost dead too. <gasps> oh, two oh. power. <laughs> Oh, two life left. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, and then you rescue your robot friends. Oh, nice. In each level. That is awesome. And that's the end of the demo. Nice. I completed it. Nice. <laughs> wow. Oh, my God. I can't wait for that game to be released on cartridge. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. Mm -hmm. So good. 
Um, anyway, sorry. Don't let that influence your votes. Because <laughs> <laughs> well. I like it so much. Um... Cobra's Nightbird? Uh, Runes of Moria, actually. Do that yes. one first? Okay. It's in alphabetical order. Fair yeah, enough. this is a 4K game <gasps> by Rossum. Look at that! <gasps> What's that from? That is from Lord of the Rings. It is! <gasps> we just had a Lord of the Rings marathon right before Christmas because it's the 20th anniversary, which yep. really makes me feel old. But anyway... <laughs> Um, oh, it's got a, are you doing this? Oh, it's no. got a demo. I know, I haven't seen this. This actually is so unbelievable for a 4K game. Where am I going? Um, Can you turn? No. So what you're looking for, yep, you turn and move. Oh my goodness, this is confusing. Is very special walls Yeah. that are flashing, like little... Um, and you'll see, you'll know when you see it. Wow. It's, it's different than other walls. This is so crazy. That wall. This wall? Go to the left. And then press forward or button on it. There you go. Now you have to decode the um, the word. Okay. But when you decode it, the picture up above will change. Carl G says, this is a definitely an epic feat. For 4K, are you, yeah, mind blown. Like, it's got these graphics. It's got 3D maze graphics. I know! It's got runes. <laughs> They're taking the hobbits to Isengard. <laughs> uh, wow. What am I doing? <laughs> this is actually easier than it appears. Just move up and down. And yeah. you'll, you'll know when it when it changes, it's the right letter. Oh, I see. It's, okay. it's really not a puzzle. There. Okay, and then you go to the next one. There. Speak friend and enter. Exactly. <laughs> and this is spells out like yeah, something from Lord of the Rings <gasps> in runes. Nice. Darcy and I actually wrote them down and decoded them. I bet you did. <laughs> <laughs> and figured out what each of them were. And then it slowly fills in the graphics with color. And I'm, I'm not up on my runic, so I, I won't be able to... Tell you what, what it Look is. At this, the music, and it's got music too. The music too. And then oh you repeat. God. Now it's a harder maze. Oh. Actually, you have to find your way to the Do next. Do I have to kill things or no? It's just. You have to find your way to the next color scheme. Color scheme. Of walls. Okay. Oh my gosh. Where the hell am I going? I, I, I really have no concept of direction, but that's okay. I'll just wander. Is this green? Was the new color scheme of walls? I think so. Fair enough. Are a lot of the calculations pre-calculated stored as a table or are they done Amazing. on the fly? That is a very good question for... Rossum. <laughs> if he pops in. Amazing. Or he can go to the chat. Oh, Amazing. Or go to the uh, Atari 8 forum. That's not it, is it? No, no, no. It's very... No, it's it's very... like... It is flickery like that, but it's more flickery. And colorful. Yeah. There it is. Oh. It's like vertical. I mean, this, this, I, I can't stare at for too long. I'm just yeah. saying. You'll just do this one and then we'll move on. Okay. <laughs> it's, it goes and goes and goes. It's, it's the same so thing over cool. and over. But it's different doors and the mazes get harder. But we got to a point in the game where you kind of hit a wall where it's like you get squished in a wall. Hey, hey. Cat! It's gotta get kicked out. <laughs> such a bad cat. Kitten! Psst. Yep, good day, cat. Okay, wow. move on to the next game. It is an unbelievable feat wow. for 4K. Like, unbelievable feat. Oh, this is amazing. Okay, next one. Uh, next one is Tober's Nightmare, which, oh my god, such a good game. <laughs> Oh, so good. So I'm going to refill uh, my water. Okay. And get some catnip for the next okay. treat time. Okay. <laughs> and then I'll come back and you'll get more wine. Cause... And then we'll show what happens when he has catnip. Wow, this is really weird. I'm not usually here by myself. 
Um, Tober's Nightmare. This is a great game. This is really fun. And again, the sprites are amazing. And it's Halloween themed. And you throw pumpkins at monsters. Oh, very poorly, apparently. <laughs> oh, that was terrible. So great. And then the wraith comes back and regrows the pumpkins. Look at this. Oh my gosh. I forgot how awesome this game is. Don't throw pumpkins when you've had two glasses of wine. I guess that's the moral of the story. <laughs> the wraith is amazing. I love the wraith. I love that the wraith is gardening <laughs> as well. Ah, oh, so good. Look at those pumpkins and like the gradations in the in the orange. Oh yeah, the, and the colors wraith, the wraith. and the graphics oh. in this are just astounding. So this is by um mick crocker mick muse mick muse get your get my heart, heart. yay and go back home water the water the things mm -hmm. pumpkins are growing yeah the crazy trees <laughs> and they shoot ah ah yeah you got to time it out so you're not grabbing yeah. a pumpkin while they're shooting at the exact spot of the pumpkin it's not too hard to avoid. Oh, at this point. <laughs> there we go. And then you run out of pumpkins, so you gotta ah, go back home. But when you've one left, they follow you. <laughs> yeah, it's... Uh, oh, you got me. Got Your foot got caught. Your head got caught. Yeah. <clears throat> Makes me remember the first boss on Goofy Troop for SNES. I did not play that game. Kitten! Behave! He's <laughs> such a bad cat. Did you get some uh, treats for him? Catnip, yeah. Catnip! So we'll do that after this game. After the... Well... After the end of this... Kitten! Oh my god! Stop it! bad cat. Oh, I died! He spins to the top. Such a great Halloween theme game. Uh, and I just, I'm terrible. That's okay. I haven't played this in a while, but I remember, well, ah, I'm going to get hit again. Ugh. What if it's a good strategy to purposely miss or there's least two enemies when you go home to reload? Yes, that is a very yeah. good strategy. It is actually. Because now it's one, very hard. One you tracks you. You should have shot this but, single one. Um, No. No? No, it's not hard. Oh. It's when you only have one left. They oh, track you. Oh, completely one Yeah, left. I believe oh. so. Okay. Well, then you have no choice. That's great. Um, but the witches track you too. So when you hit the witch level, can you hear this cat? Can you hear him? Meowling. Like, like he's, he's been he's being abused in some way. <laughs> like <laughs> he's abusing us. <laughs> yeah. I, what are you doing? <laughs> he's nuts. You're crazy He's cat. nuts. Just calm yourself. What is up with you today? Calm your fur. Calm it. Calm he it. He cannot calm his fur. Calm oh! Your fur. You can hear him? Oh my god. <laughs> it has an Magic at Activision vibe. It does. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. oh my god. I can't believe you made it through I that. know. Me too. I thought I was going to die. Are those ghosts blue? <gasps> Slightly blue? Oh, damn. They are. They are not white. They wow. have a slight... Cyanish tinge. Oh, you can shoot um, diagonally. Yeah. Ah, ah, ah. ah. Oh, it's great that it's they're so just... It's so good. It's so good. Ah, why are you shooting? <laughs> there, of all places. Of course. Our cats can hear them on the surround sound. <laughs> they're skittish <laughs> now. <laughs> ah, 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 what's going on? Skittish. What's wrong with that cat? I don't think that why word is, is uh, ever used uh, to describe anything but cats. Yeah, that's right? true. Skittish cats. Oh, God. Uh, I'm just being terrible. I'm not playing very well, but... Oh, and there he goes. Into the ground. Oh. 
two lilies. white lilies. Two white lilies. And it scrolls down. That's so great. Just beautiful, beautiful. finishing touches on Look this at game. Look that. Huge title screen with yes, the eyes. very magic. Gorgeous. Yes. Okay. Uh, then one last game on a work in progress homebrew original. Mm -hmm. And it involves hooking up the Quatari. <laughs> Esther Ramirez says, take my money. Yeah, yes. no kidding. What a great Halloween game. It is. Okay, so you can go to Vroom. I'll plug this in after loading. After loading? Okay, you got to move your butt. <laughs> Look at that. Looks great. Oh yeah. Oh, Atari for two. Mm. Ready? Okay, you press your button, that'll be your car. What? Press your button. I am. Oh. Oh. Oh, we have to. Something's wrong. Oh, oh now we're good. I'm yellow, you're blue. Four-player game, right? Eight-player game. That's insane! By Thomas Yanch. First simultaneous eight-player game on the 2600. Wow. I came in second to last. And last! Woo! So, <laughs> this uses just the buttons. Oh, thank you for following Big Dog Suzzy for, <laughs> for 2069. If that was not a, the most... Uh, what would be the most typical, stereotypical internet name. Yeah. <laughs> um, so, yeah, this uses the quadtari and the buttons on the paddles. Yeah. Because the buttons emulate the left and right of the joysticks. Oh, I see. So that means you can play, you can't play four eight player paddle games with the quadtari, mm. um, but you can play eight player button games with the quad tar. So like quiz games and stuff like that or racing games. Mm -hmm. So in this game you have to press the button when you're on top of the arrows. If you press the button when you're not on top of the arrows it slows you down. Press the button when you are on top of the arrows it speeds you up. Tan is blue, I am yellow. And there's different um, levels of enemies you can run against. So when we have our um, our next retro, uh, game, retro night? game night, we're going to bring eight people down to the game room and try and get an eight player game of terrible at this game. Second to last again. <laughs> it's hard. It's, it's hard, hard to trigger i don't know yeah this game is for people with friends sold yes. separately yes yeah <laughs> yeah it is basically a rhythm game it is that a rhythm is game true that's true uh if you don't you don't have to have a quad tari to play yes this. prge but yes we'll have an eight way uh oh, someone has a quad tari at prg no, al's, al's already gonna do it oh is he yeah awesome so al says awesome. he's going to either have a big tv yeah for this because you can't get eight people around a small mm. Uh, 1702 monitor, Commodore monitor. Yeah. <laughs> or uh, somebody recommended a s video splitter. Okay. And have four monitors in a row so people can just watch the same thing because they all say, see the same stuff. Uh, no, I think the arrows are the same, but as you get behind or ahead, you hit them at different times. No. Like they're not every randomized. single race. Oh, I don't know. I, I that's a good question. I don't know. Knowing Thomas, they're probably randomized. Yeah. The short ones are harder because you have a run the chance of slowing down rather than speeding up. I 
feel like I speed up and then I some do something stupid and then I slow right down. Uh, I think I'm not. I was doing this. well and and then I was and then getting like worse. I'm worse. I got worse. <laughs> I was like getting ahead now. and oh, it's it's challenging. It's a challenging Very challenging. Game. Dragster, yes, yeah. Oh, it's on hard difficulty. Oh, cool in a cocktail style cabinet with everyone looking down. Yeah. Oh, gathered around. You need a big round everybody has table a button. with a button. Yeah. How cool would that be? Around because you don't need to be looking at it dead on. You're just timing yes, cocktail your cocktail cabinet type. But a big because my my parents mm. our dining table is a glass round table. Right. And we sit around the glass round table, and you just need to install a little monitor in the bottom of it. So <laughs> and this it should would be an be easier awesome. one. Pull out your controller and play the game. Oh. Is this easy? I think so, yeah. I had it set for some reason to. Super hard? Oh, because I was testing out a game that used one of the switches. Well, this one has a lot more longer um, speed up, even though last time. I don't think I'm holding it as long as I could be holding it. Well, I feel I'm scared to hold it for too long. Oh, yay, third. Much better. Yeah, much easier. Much better. So we'll play one more was on I this. Was I actually playing? No, I wasn't. You were just playing. What? I don't know. You started. I don't know. I was hitting it, but I don't know if I was actually playing. Okay, start your car. No, it's okay. Start you your play. car. You play. Oh. You play. I miss cocktail cabinets. Those are the best. Get your drink. Play your game. Play your in first. I was in first! Come and come last! Oh, says this is an astounding amount of game to fit into 2K. Yes. Oh, <gasps> yes, that's right. Ivory, uh, no, it's 4K. Ivory um, Tower Collections has a Galaga cocktail cabinet as his coffee table. Oh my table. god, I'm envious. <laughs> James is like drooling now. <laughs> that's so awesome. That is so awesome. Yeah. Uh, but this is, this is an incredible game for 4K. It, mm -hmm. uh, and it, you can play eight people mm -hmm. on it it looks amazing it's got all the engine sounds for all eight cars mm -hmm. somehow they're all going and like they take priority over one another depending um yeah super super cool game so if somebody wants to do the cat feeding i don't know if it's time yet <laughs> Is it time yet? I don't know, but we'll, they... We'll do the catnip for him. We can just do the t catnip if no one's in the mood to uh, ring the bell. That's fine. It's Are treat time. Yum, yum, Yay! yum, yum. Treat time. Stephanie, thank you. You get a special treat this time. Yeah. It's catnip. Yeah, you're getting catnip. He's confused. He's like, where's the... Uh... Oh, I think he'll be happy with this. Oh, that's way too much. <laughs> way too much. Yeah. He, he, oh, there we go. There's some catnip. Yeah. We haven't had catnip. No. <laughs> Didn't even think about it. I wish I had enough channel points. No. Oh, no. Oh. Somebody's got enough channel points. It's not, we don't make it too much. Kitty uppers time. Yep. Yeah, scale or to measure it. Yeah, yeah. You kind of lays and drools and rolls his head on the bowl usually but that's upstairs he's never eaten mm -hmm. it on the carpet because it's a big mess mm -hmm. but oh he's throwing it everywhere oh he does do that but yeah. it is time to vacuum this weekend it is <laughs> it's true yeah yep. yeah it does need a good vacuum <laughs> so next up we're going to be playing um best work in progress homebrew port okay for 2600 mm. so these are all games that you know and love, mm -hmm. or you might know and love, um, that people have taken upon themselves to convert to the 2600. Nice. Asteroids cabinet, that would be very cool. Mm -hmm. uh, watch the cat get drunk and tear up the game room. <laughs> yeah. No. No. <laughs> I hope not. No. He'll start rolling around in the in the catnip in a second. There he goes. There he goes. There He's rubbing he goes. the rubbing the bowl. Starting to rub. Oh, him. there we go. <laughs> yeah. He's high. That's a high cat right there. 
Yeah, give him a second. Oh. There we go. He's just so happy right now. <laughs> It'll last for a couple minutes. It will. <laughs> He's covered in catnip. Oh, he is. It's all over his head. He'll rub the bowl. Yeah. <laughs> He'll bang it because usually it's on the hardwood upstairs. So yeah. Like, so you bang, hear this bang, 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 bang. bang, bang. bang, bang. Yeah. He's like, oh, there's some on the floor. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh, hi, kitties. Yeah. <laughs> and he'll start grooming. Yeah. Ran random <laughs> grooming. <laughs> oh. And the funny thing is, um, Pixel just never reacted this way. Not, no, he just kind of ate it. And, and then just wandered there. away. And then, and then Atari was always like, woo. <laughs> just say no to catnip, kids. Yes. Hi. <laughs> hi. Hi. Hi, kitty. <laughs> 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 Today I've Sorry. relearned about the version of Unix for the Atari TT workstation. Should I port that to the 20s? Uh. Do it! This is your burn a cat. <laughs> yeah, drunk kitten cat. Drunk kitten cat. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Are you good? Are you good? Let's hook things back up to normal. Yeah. Yeah, he's a half cat. Thank you. <laughs> Can you get different catnip strengths? Not that I'm aware I of. I don't know. I don't they think just it... kind of immediately react to it. I'm not sure people put that much effort yeah. into it. I'm, I don't know. Interesting. Catnip is a, is a species of mint. Yes. Yeah. So, I don't know. You can water it down with mint. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, let's go to the first one, which is 1942. Oh. Which is oh. one of my favorite games. Oh, you have to... This cat... Oh, you, you're missing. Oh, no. Oh, uh, he was... There he goes. There he goes. <laughs> Look at him. It's crazy. <laughs> Super high. <laughs> and roll around to the tune of 1942. <laughs> exactly. He's very excited for 1942. The music on this title it's screen beautiful. is such a good rendition of the 1942 music. Yeah. Uh, it is one of my favorite shooters. Yeah. Uh, along with its sequel, 1943. Um, so I'm really excited that this has been ported. Uh, it's been. Uh, it was started by Homer Homer, and then Alnifer uh, kind of took over the development, and also Pat Brady uh, contributed the sound, the music to it. And I'm just chilling to the music right it's now. It's such a good rendition of it's the so song. Good. So uh, you should use the Genesis controller for looping. Oh. Oh. Yes, I've actually never plugged in the Genesis controller for playing this game. Nice. Can you plug it in after it's started? Or is it gonna freak out? Can you hold this? Hold it. Restart out in the first S. Okay. Pull down the middle button. I've used the Genesis in, on this for a long time. You you should play it. You play it. Then. Okay. Yeah. You. Yay! It says there's a Genesis controller. It does. Yep. Oh look at that. I was just reading about the button reading scheme for the Genesis C button, and it pulls the paddle port. Paddle uh, reads the paddle. So it's got the ship, or the um, the, uh, the big ship you take off from. Um, I don't know if this version has... Oh, it does have the rain planes. Uh, I missed one, and I crashed into it, trying to get it. Oh, I get another chance. No, no, no. There we go. And it's got the POW. So now my weapon is upgraded. Oh, no, we ran away. <laughs> it's got all the little islands. Look at that. 
Uh, we haven't played this on the show in a long time. No. Because I was waiting for like um, the right opportunity to to play an upgraded version of it. Yes. And then you land on the next carrier ship. And you take off from the next one. Get to the boss, James, as Ramirez says. I've never made it to the boss, actually. So let's see if Gotta I can... Gotta try. And there's the big plane. <gasps> oh, I didn't kill it. That's okay. So let's see if I can make it to the boss. I love it. <laughs> oh, I killed it, I think. It does need explosions for planes. I think that would be a really good addition to it. Some kind of boom, yeah. Yeah, so you know, because they kind of... Right now, they just dis disappear. Yeah. Or a sound, at least. Yeah. Because right now, they just poop out of existence. Pow! Lots of opportunities for pows. And and oh. they need to work on the the patterns mm. a little bit. Oh, so, but look at this. You're back on the aircraft carrier. Aircraft nice! Carrier. But other than that, it's got... The sound, it's got the movement, it's got the right graphics, it's got the right music. It's amazing. It's amazing. Uh, yeah, it's got the annoying um, whistle tweets that it has <laughs> in the original game. Oh, oh nice. yeah, bring it on. And oh, because no. Because I'm so large. Yeah. <laughs> and those things took up the whole screen. And now I need the powers back. Nope. There's a problem. Mm. Maybe it should just go double ship first. Mm. Because three is huge. I'm enjoying this. But it would be nice to have three ships. Percussive uh, music going on. I like it. I haven't done loop yet. I'll do a loop. Those bottom right things are for looping. Nice. The animation for the looping is perfect. Great job, Al. This was, oh, changed color in the background. This was actually on my list of games that I wished were ported to oh, really? the 2600. Nice. Was and that a baby shark? So I, baby <laughs> shark. Um, so now I've crossed that off the list. I mean, I'd still love it for the 7800 because you could do a lot with that. Esther Mayer says you have two loops left. Yep. So that's the bottom right where it shows the loops. Really want to change into three planes. It's no, because it seems like big. if one gets hit, then you you all die. You lose a life. Yeah, yeah. that's a bit a bit extreme. Then you lose your power ups too. Oh, how many aircraft carriers do you need to get to 20? before the boss? <laughs> I don't know. It says twenty eight. Yeah. Yeah, cool play field animation. Yeah, the scrolling. It would be. Uh, I mean, I don't know how much better they can make it, but to get it a little bit finer movement for the playfield scrolling down, because mm. right now it's a little chunky, it's like four or even eight pixels movement. Ooh, I think I want to stay at this power level, because I don't want to be triple ships. says this is my favorite PU. <laughs> PU. I don't know what that, is, that means. Power up. Pow Power up. Power up. <laughs> That's all I can think of. Power up, yes. <laughs> okay. In terms of looks? Or just... Or just the way it works? Mm. It's a wider, wider shot, maybe? Oh, it's favorite power up. Yeah. yeah. I think I'll stick with this one because the bullets are wide and it's mm. a double one. Neometer says how big is the round? It is 16K, mm. which is pretty good. Mm -hmm. How many more mm -hmm. sorties till the boss? Lots of sorties. Lots of sorties. Hey, die. Come on. Do I have to shoot the left one? Oh, I do have to shoot the left one. That's a problem. No, nope. I don't want it. You want the yellow? I, is that the, the I, three? I don't think... Yeah, maybe. Does the color tell you what it is? Because some are red. Some are red, some yeah. are white. I mean, it might just be to distinguish it from the background, too. But. Yeah, it could be. Yeah, that's a problem. What does oh. Al have to say about the uh, shooting the left one? Or has that been fixed? You can collect multiple power-ups, Al says. Yeah, but I don't want to be three this ships. This version has no improved collision detection. Okay. Oh, okay. So it's been better. Mm. It's been improved. We're playing the 
the awards the, version the, of the it. awards one which was released at a certain time right yeah, yeah. december 31st is the cutoff yeah so looks great it great does now when's the boss well you're 26 so has that changed yeah it goes down by one oh time. my god <laughs> Do I have to make 26 rounds to get to the boss? <laughs> That's a lot. I mean, I can, because I've still got yeah. six ships left. The latest version is great. Mm. It is very cool. At least I know how to kill all these guys now. Shoot the left one. Should I go for a power-up? Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm going to die. I am going to die. I think I'll stay very high on the screen. Because the large ships mm -hmm. will just take me out. Like the large planes, I mean. Oh my god. Stages are counted backwards, yeah. So really, I have to do 27 levels? 26 levels? Use the loop, Alnifer says. Oh, to avoid the big ships. Oh, uh -huh. the boss! I made it! Oh my god, those bullets are... <gasps> Good Yay! job! Woo! That was awesome! I love how your ship is... Your plane's kind of off because you triple. Uh, Didn't kind of plan for that. I think you need to move it over a little bit. Well, you just land wherever you, the middle one lands, probably. Yeah, or the left. Mm. I, I do really like the percussive music. Yeah? Yes! Do, 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 I do. Do, do. Very good emulation of the uh, whistle. The boss was uh, surprisingly easy. Because yeah. I had lots of powers. Yeah. Ah! More pows! Mm -hmm. Okay. I think we'll have to quit. Is the progressive music a message in Morse code? Possibly. <laughs> oh, maybe. I do not know Morse code, so... No. I do remember in Girl Guides having short, to learn uh, Semaphore, which is with the flags, oh. Oh. and having a little folded card for, for, you know, passing Semaphore messages. Anyone else? Semaphore? Does that ring any bells? Anyone? Uh, oh, Boy Scouts? Uh, girl okay. girl Guides? Done. Yeah. We're going to move on. Yeah. It's a super awesome port of 1942. Um... Have a good night, Neo Media. Good Thank night, you for Neo joining. Media. Next game is Paint the City. Oh, we have to get rid of this. Oh, what's going on? It's what happens when you don't press the mail button. I know what they are, but I never learned them. I don't. I certainly don't remember them now, but I do remember there there being this big thing about semaphore in Girl Guides. Okay. So next game. It's funny that I remember what that word is. Even yeah. I'm just shocked, but I had a little folding card with the semaphore flag. So. Yes, Paint the City, 8K by Splendid Nut. Who's in the chat tonight? Or was in the chat? Eight, what is it? Paint the City. Paint the City. Alphabetical order. I never learned semaphore. Great title yeah. screen. Oh, Splendid Nut. I remember this one. So you have to paint the city. Paint all the different parts. Avoid the cat. Pick up those cans, which are the um, vertical lines. And oh. you can shoot the other cars with them. And I believe the cat as well. Oh, uh, You nope. ran into it just as you shot. Oh, I see. Nope. So okay. it has oil. Oh, there we go. How much oil you have. Do you I want to get, get that balloons. balloon? Yep. Poor kitties. Don't hit the kitties. No. Bad food. Tons of great games. The best of the best during the awards. So, try and shoot a car when you get a chance. I didn't jump. Well, the game says you did. Meow. Meow. Probably just being a little so Don't jump up into a cat. that car if you have a can oh, oh you can't yet it's a work in progress ah 
I'm gonna land on the car. <laughs> you can turn around. Yeah, but he was moving. With you? Yeah. Oh, that's okay. Weird. It's a work of progress. It's all good. It's cute though. I, I like it. I love the backgrounds. The yep. cityscapes. Scrolling Beautiful. with. Beautiful. Oh, it is a uh, parallax because it's not scrolling at the exact same time as the roads. Mm. I would never expect this game to get a port. It's too obscure. Yeah, no kidding. There are t so many arcade games. It's unbelievable how many arcade games there are that just never saw the light of day for a port on any system. I believe this is one of them. I don't know if this was ever ported to any system. Do not sit on that amp. <laughs> if I know this was going to be nominated, I would have worked on it more last year. Uh -huh. That's fine. It'll uh, propel you to work on finishing it. <laughs> there you go. And then you can uh, try and get nominated for uh, one of the completed categories. Okay, we I think that's the extent to this. <laughs> unless you're going to try and actually paint all of them. Well, I was going to, but that's okay. You're getting you don't close. Have to. No, you're getting really close, so you might as well finish it. You only got like a couple more left. Calm yourself, Gav. So bad. Oh. But at the top. Psst. Atari, please. He's like, what? I'm being a cat. What? Look at that. You can do it. Oh. You're almost done. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, you have one more tiny spot up there. <gasps> Tiny little spot. And you're done there. Yay! We'll see. Done. Cat's after you. Cat's after you. Uh, cats. I'll keep going to left, see if there's any left. I don't think it has a yeah. end. Cool. Nope. Nope. You did it. Yay! Woo! You did all the stuff you can do. Okay, next one. Okay. Thank you, Splendid. Never knew of this game until it popped up on Nintendo Switch Online NES. Oh. And Kicks Demo 2 NTSC. It's made by Champ Games, John Champo, uh, Nathan Strum and Bob, uh, for graphics, and Bob DeCrescenzo for sound. And this is obviously an arcade port of Kix, which is a super fun game. You fill the screen mm -hmm. up to the percentage that it wants you to fill it. So you're at 28% out of 70. And it shows you your lives at the top right. You're on life one of three. There's little sparky guys coming after you. There's the kicks in the middle. <gasps> Run! And you can't, don't want to let that middle line get you uh get your line that you're drawing or you which counts pretty much the same the kicks exists on the 2600 is astonishing yeah, it is it's, amazing it's one of those impossible games <laughs> that uh john shampoo went nah i can do it <laughs> and it's because of how chunky the play field is Everybody thought, oh, it's too chunky to do it. Because, you know, you can see the thickness of the line, right? And that is the minimum you can make a line. Ooh. Ooh. So if you stop drawing, that little spark comes after you. And eventually will follow you along. So you can't just sit there and think about things. Ooh! Contemplate life. Don't know life. how that... Uh... This version is even better than the official ah! Atari 8-bit version. I'm not great at this game. <laughs> Usually, John Champo's uh, ports are better than much more capable machines, ports of the same game. Oh, for God's sakes. So you can do a fast draw and you can do a slow draw yeah, with the can. button. And you get more points with a slow draw, but you get it done faster with a fast Ooh. draw. Last life. Terrible. Oh, yeah. Let's fix that. What's going on? It goes, it's a little nuts on this game. It's a bit much for um, 60 hertz signal to, 
to handle. But there is a setting, as there is usually on games that do nut crazy things, um, to give the option of not filled in. Ooh. Oh, I don't know why I did that. Mm, that was bad. My turn. I've done much better on this game, but that's okay. Loving attention and technical chops. Great game, yes. Yep. You are PL1. I, I've done much better on this game <laughs> when we were playing before. Yeah. Oh, it's a fun game. Oh, it's so good. I love games like this ah. where there's like a little frantic element to it and a puzzly element to it. Those are the greatest. Yes. Look at you. Look at you. That's oh. Dying. Look at me dying. Now I'm going to do that special move. I just forgot to do it. Um, on the next level. Mm. It's one of those games you can call unique. Yeah. yeah, there's nothing like it. There's just... It's a, it's its own genre, really. Yeah. So what you do is you do... This, Little one? And then you do... Ah, oh, you don't do that! I don't I think I can it. rescue it. No. I don't know. And I can't remember what you, happens you, you after. You enclose it in the box, right? I can't remember. I don't know. That. It's too late. <laughs> and I think they stay up there just by doing that. They get stuck. Oh, yeah. they don't. I can't... Oh, you... No, you you, you have to as a little one, and then as it gets in the little one, you encircle it, and I think right. it gets stuck. Right. Yeah. Oh, I've messed this level up, so. That's all good. I did it last turn. Yeah, you did. It's such a fun game. Nice. Da -da -da. Let's see if I can do it this time. Oh, that was two of them. Now there's two of them. Let's see if I can do it this time. Oh, go away. Don't thwart my... Oh, no, I'm not going to be able to do it. Oh, I might be able to. You have to make a long one, don't you? No. There. I think you have to... No, you have to go back in. I can't remember how to do it. You now. have to create one and then do like a circle one. I don't know. It doesn't matter. I can't remember. Split the kicks. Yeah, split you want to split it. Uh, split it. Let's try that. Do it. If I can't do one thing, I'll do another. I'll yeah. Do this. Ooh, boo. There we go. Get out of here. No. <gasps> Naughty kicks. That was close. Nice. Split kicks. All scores now two times original value. Mm -hmm. Let's try to do it again. And again and again and again and again. Oh, no, they're hanging around each other. Oh, that was close. <laughs> oh, 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 they're separating a little bit. A little bit. <gasps> gotcha. He gotcha. Which, which got me? The spark? Or the, the spark did. Oh. Good job. So, Excellent. awesome game. Definitely so download it good. if you haven't played it. So good. Um, it is super, super awesome. The next one is Ruby Q, <laughs> of which we are going to be playing the final version? exclusive version when we come back after the Atari Homebrew Awards. I was just playing it the other day. Oh my god. It is super awesome. This is amazing. Like even that. Look everything that. everything about this, this intro, is unbelievable. Oh, it's beautiful. It is beautiful. So let's do easy. We'll do classic graphics. We'll do mad Look mode. Oh, that Actually, is we'll do so classic cool. mode on normal. And then we'll do crazy mode on easy. It's beautiful. So good! It's so fast and so nice looking. Really looking forward to Ruby Kusa's Nostalgia. Yeah, this is so good. It's probably one of the it's best beautiful. ports of Cubert. I don't think Q-Bert. I've seen it. Really? No! We've played what? other Cubert games, but. You've never seen this one? No, I don't know if I have. I think you have. 
I know I did play with Darcy, so you, you may did. not have. You did. I don't know if I've seen this I one. I played it with Darcy uh, because we... you don't like Cuber games. Uh, exactly. But this is the best, <laughs> best Cuber game you will ever play. I have a, I, I, I have a pattern. Yeah. It is not a mod. This is 100% from the ground up. Yeah. I just want to say diagonal movement is uh, an offense to nature. I, I, that is my feeling, <laughs> my personal feeling towards Cubert. Not anything to do with the development of this game, which is beautiful. Yeah, the speed is exactly right. Um, yeah. And uh, you get smooth movement. It's beautiful, though. It looks amazing. Look at the jumping snake. Oh, my God. Oh, my yeah. God. He's sprungy. You have to jump on one of those platforms, too. I just want to see. Oh, I will. Probably this round. Yeah. Nope. Can I finish it? Nope. I'll have to use the snake. Nice. Oh, I have to actually... <gasps> plug this in. I remember, Tiny, that you did play this on a prior show. Maybe I did. Um, Maybe I'm I I'm gonna did. plug in the Atari box. I, I thought I played a different version, though, but, because there have been a number of versions of oh, Qbert. Yeah. Uh, we did play a different, at one point, a different... A different version. I just don't recall if it was this one, but it looks great. Yeah, Carl G agrees with me. I can never get my brain to translate the re directions of Qbert either. It, it's a weird game that I have disliked from childhood. <laughs> I don't know. The diagonal movement just never, no. It doesn't work with your no, brain. No, I don't know. I just never liked it. And it's not that the game itself is offensive. I just don't like the movement. It just uh, I'm going to plug in the way. Atari box. Are you? I don't know if this has the sounds, this version. <laughs> but it does have sound. Oh my god, of course he went up. Yeah. Yeah, they're so lively. They're so good. Ah. The bad guys are all good. Everything about this game is immaculate. Yeah. And the final version is <gasps> even better. Oh my god! Stop dying! This isn't even the hard part. If you don't like diagonal movement, don't try pump it up. I don't even know that one. Pump mm. it up. Just, you just remap your brain after a while. It's like, oh, that's that I way, know, that's that I way. I know, I know, I know. Yep. I'm Snake pretty is... sure I had a terrible version on the Commodore 64 as a child. Oh, you bastard! Come back here! Oh. It's almost done. It's changing my face. Pump it as I've DDR, but I can't do that time. Instead of four cardinal directions, you have the four directional arrows. Four diagonal arrows in the center. Diagonal? Really? Like DDR? Dance Dance Revolution? Really? Interesting. Hmm. I don't dislike Dance Dance Revolution. Oh my god. Um, no, DDR is good. It's hard. I'm not good at it. Oh, I like, I like DDR. We had it, didn't we? Yeah. We had the we had the Xbox 360 version with the pad. Terrible mat. Yeah, Terrible the mat was not great. Um, but yeah, you play that for half an hour and you burn a few calories. Get it's your fun. workout. Yeah. Yeah, I've, I've looped around. Oh, it looks great. Oh, there's a cat who wants in. Sorry. Yeah, he's a bad cat, though. Oh, we like bad cats, though. Okay. Oh, he ran away. That's okay. Here, here. Just hold this. I'm going to plug in the Atari box. I think. I don't know if this uses it or not. Are you still feeling high? Atari box. No. Are you still high? Ready. No. He wears off after no. five minutes. Are you still high? Oh, he's happy though. That's just what he wanted. Pets? Or being like, kicked out of the room? No. <laughs> Getting a little cat. He hasn't had it in a while. Yeah, sweetie. Oh, the Q-Bird. Or the Ruby Q. The Ruby Q. Mm -hmm. Oh, it doesn't have. Doesn't have the voices in this one. Mm. Um, but we'll play the. Mad mode? What is that? Did we play? Classic? Yeah, mad? mad on easy this time. What is mad? It has craziness. It has the lightning. Oh. And it has freezing. Oh, cool. 
Uh, we'll go for class. Well, scan line makes it flashy, mm. but also we'll, we'll leave that off. And it, oh, it has teleporters. Oh my god. Oh, I love the teleporters. <sighs> That's so cool. A bit of a pain in the ass, though. And it has moving platforms, so you don't know, like, those move around. So they're not always where you want. <gasps> the other guys can mm -hmm. teleport through them, too, I so you have to watch for that, that. too. It adds a lot more challenge. Mm -hmm. A two-player co-op and new enemies, too. Oh, nice. Yeah, this is not the full version, so it doesn't have this, the demo. So it doesn't have two-player, I don't think. i check, but I don't think so. Yeah, because we played the full version on the show, which did have two-player. Yes. That was, that was fun. Cool. Oh, my God. You pretty much have... The teleporters are a real pain when you're... God, get out of here. When you're trying to change them like two colors or they turn mm -hmm. off and on. Yeah. 40. Oh my god. Oh, invisible. Nice bonus. Oh, this is the bonus level, right? This is where you have to keep as many lit <gasps> as possible. Mm. I don't think you lose lives. Or maybe you do. Stop it! And then you stay near the top? Because you can keep guard them. Oh, I see. So I just missed two. That's really good. That's good. Now there's two teleporters. Let's get rid of those right away. <laughs> so there's a lot of extras. Mm. Oh, I'm gonna take that right now. It's about to disappear. If you're like it's so smooth, yeah, it is. It's so smooth. If you love Qbert, this is like. Here. This has so many more options. It's like, oh, I'm bored of normal keyboard. There's a lot of extras. That was close. That guy freezes cubes, yeah. so if you land on a frozen cube, you slow right down. Oh my <gasps> god. That's what I do all the time when I go through teleporters. Because you're going in a certain direction, and then you're teleported, and you're right near the edge. Fun game! Yes, good night, Mike Soul! Good night, Mike Soul! I think we've got one more after this, or uh, two more? A couple, I think. Yeah. James is responsible to keep it all night. Well, this is the last game of Cubert. <laughs> it's good, it's so good. I wasn't a fan of Cubert before this. Now I'm a fan of Cubert. Yeah? Mm. See that? Watch this. Oh, I remember. It makes your joystick go crazy. It, you press direction, it's random. Oh no! Like I'm gonna jump off because I have no idea. Which way I'm going. Ah! Give it to me. What is the green? Gives you some extra time. Where you're not invincible, but um, freezes all the enemies. Nice. But there were no enemies. There, so. Yeah, so even... But it stopped better. enemies from coming on. Yes. So do not run into Mr. Electricity. It's, oh. You're pretty much going to die. two levels in the demo. Maybe three. So cool. You're much better at this game than <laughs> I am for sure. I've gotten better since practicing on this game. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's going to disappear. One more. Yay! Oh, bonus. So really you have to... Do a lot of the bottom ones first, and then start Working clearing up. your way up. Bastards. There. Then you can start protecting and filling out some of the tops. <gasps> no! Oh, okay. Well, not, eh, not too bad. Yeah. Yes? What would you like, sir? Oh, now I'm back to level what one. What would you okay. like? Oh. Next game! Nope. Calm down. 
Um, oh, the poll is closed. Oh, I don't think many people voted after. Well, you want to revisit it and see what the final... Uh... It's going to be the same. And it's yeah. going to be dark and impossible to read. What do you mean? The web page makes it like a dark color right. on black. And it makes it impossible to oh, read. So okay. we can't really look at it. Okay. All right. Here you go. Tom Hawk 777. All right. Oh. This is a port by Carlos Centeno. Centeno? The aliens are coming. So this is a very interesting game. You're a submarine. You played this? Yes. Uh -huh. Really? Uh -huh. Enemies come down. Yes, I did. Yeah. And they drop their spinning bombs, and it gets <gasps> right into it. Oh, yeah. And the water line goes down. Lower and lower. It's like gives you less room. You can move up and down. Oh, yeah. Yep. Move in the opposite direction on this game. Just like that level on... Yeah, um, fine. Now you got it. He did the end. Yes, he has a very distinct look to his games. And I think that's because he picks a very particular era of arcade games that had a certain graphical look to them. Oh, God. Oh, oh, oh. my God. Uh, I don't know how I did that. What a recovery. Are. He does like... The late 70s, very early 80s arcade games. The end is my jam, Canadian tenor says. <laughs> Correct, the end. Yeah. Game over. Oh my goodness, that was fast. My turn. All right. Oh. Oh. Give me a second. Dangerous near the top, but you can take him out really quick. Oh, somebody followed. I can't see it until it's time for in between levels. Let's see if I can do it now. Thank you for following Moist Pug. <laughs> nice name. <laughs> Thank you for following and enjoying the gaming. By the way, if anybody's just joined in, we are playing all the nominees for the Atari Homebrew Awards, the fourth annual Atari Homebrew Awards. Oh god, am I down here? Stuck down here? Nope, oh, good. And we're playing the Atari 2600 Best Work in Progress Ports right now. So these are games that are not done, but they're being worked on, so they're not finished. Um, and they are ports of existing games. They could be arcade games. They could be a game from a computer. Or it could be a game from another console. Oh my god, that's right. I don't think I've died yet, have I? No. Uh, they could even be a game that was on the 2600 <laughs> and remade. Because that has happened. People are like, the original one was garbage. Mm. Um, because people have remade Pac-Man and Ms. Pac-Man. Because, you know, Ms. Pac-Man was pretty good. But they've remade lots of... Damn Oof. it. It's cornered. What other games have been remade on mm. the 2600 that were released on the 2600? Donkey Kong. Donkey Kong, yes, yeah. that's for sure. Uh, very poor ports. What was Mario Bros. on? Uh, they did make a version. Well, we we played that, that on the seventy eight. That was the seventy eight. Talking about okay. twenty six hundred. Yeah, they no, no, I wasn't sure. I was um, because there was a seventy eight hundred version that yep. wasn't great. It was not yeah. great. Yeah. It was it was okay. Yeah. Very poor. <laughs> oh, and Popeye was um. Popeye version? Popeye was on the 2600. Yes. Was it on the 7800 too? Um, I, yeah, it, I'm sure. But the yes, new it was. version was 2600 
or nope, 78, 78 no, it was 78. And it just destroys, mm. destroys the original version. Oh, it's amazing. Would you there have been brews of Space Invaders. Would you consider a game remade from a phone game of port? Oh, yeah, any mm. platform, mm -hmm. any. Um, and Flappy Birds. Flappy Birds, yeah, yep. great example, mm -hmm. actually. Okay, next game. Yay. At our epoch, plus no, we're on to the last one Turbo Arcade, a 64k port. Last one of the night, uh, by mm. Champ Games, John Champo, coding and design, Nathan Strum, art and graphics and sound effects. This is an astounding game, mm -hmm. it is a technological marvel, it is like a movie being played. Yeah. These games don't load well. Oh no. Is EF it games. Failed? Yeah, it should be on my Uno cart. Mm. Because they don't play well with my Harmony and my RGB. At our epoch plus. Let's see. Ready. Nope. Nope. There's lead left now. Uh. I'm going to have to load it. Do you want to try, try it again? Harmony again? Do you want to try it again? Yeah. But then I'll, at the same time, I'm going to load it on too. Okay. If it uh, no. doesn't quite work. At plus. Oh, oh, probably already. won't work on a Uno. Oh, you know what? I got a special cart for this, didn't I? Did you? Can I get a special cart? No. Did I? I can't remember. <laughs> Is this a special cart? Oh, well, we're putting in a special cart now. The world will see what the special cart contains. A black At our epoch, um, yeah. unlabeled uh, cart. Ready. Yep, yep, yep. There yeah, I, we go. I have go. to have a special cart for this to play it. Novice? Novice. Um, so this is... <gasps> oh, yes. This is not the newest version, maybe? I would have to flash it. Uh, this will give you a good example of it. And this is also not the demo version. It's so not? You just have to oh. deal with it. This is the full version. Yeah. But it's the it's game. It's full? Oh. Yeah. Okay. This is a beautiful game. Those colors are wrong on your Uno. <laughs> Maybe I need to update it. The colors? Yeah. Really? It's probably a new update for the Uno. Did you get to see what... Uh, We'll pop the Uno in after this and see what version it's running on. Yeah, the play f the playfield graphics are incredible, and they are basically a full screen, uncompressed stream of data that's been encoded and is just showing frame after frame of of playfield that were rendered. Oh my god, you guys got to just watch the original Turbo yeah. premiere. Um, John Champo explains it all. Mm -hmm. um, it was like rendered in 3D and then exported. I can't remember what it was. It was crazy. What's an Uno? It is a... Ah, ah, I'm blocking my view! It's this cart. Ah. So small. It's uh, a very inexpensive multi-card SD card based system that you can plug into your 2600 and like it's original like, hardware uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, and um, you can put an SD card load games <gasps> onto it it does not support CDFJ games but it does support ace games which there aren't any of publicly yet so um, you are missing out on some some titles with getting the Uno, um, but it is a very inexpensive. Uh, well, depends on which version you get. Because if you get a Harmony card, it's the same price pretty much, or even cheaper than the Uno. But if you get the Harmony Encore, which will enable you to do more games, um, twenty six hundred multi card. There you go. There was a guy that just sat and played this over and over again at Multicon. I bet. But just look it's up good game. Uno Kart online and um, you'll be able to find it. So these are really the 
too big. Plus plus cart. But um, plus cart's a kind of a different beast. So there's 26, there's the Uno cart and the Harmony cart and Harmony Encore. And then, a, and then a, a branch off of the Uno cart is the plus cart, which doesn't have an SD card slot, but it has a Wi-Fi chip in it that you can connect up to the internet and put your games on through the Wi-Fi and load your games off your computer. Um, or play games off a repository of other people's homebrew that they've uploaded yeah. onto the Plus Store. And there's also a chat on the Plus Cart. You Which can is crazy. Chat. There's, there's a lot of stuff. <laughs> yeah. There's a lot of stuff. Yeah. And there's also Plus Cart SD, but you have to make those yourself at the nice. moment. Yeah. Plus Cart is my jam. Yes. Um, but the Harmony Cart could be reflashed via USB. Yes. Oh, is this going to save oh, sure. your score? Yeah, sure. Bring me. It's not a great score. <laughs> so let's play standard. And we'll play this once more. It is beautiful, though. Oh, it's gorgeous. Uh, for a 2600 game, the colors and the backgrounds. The sounds. Ah, oh, my God. Smacky smack. You stay to the side start up so the cars mm -hmm. don't smash into you. Uh, oh, that smash. It's been a while since I played this. Mm -hmm. Oh, he crashed into the other guy mm -hmm. and then smashed into me. Oh my god, this is the dangerous part. You kind of want to maintain a speed. Get a car on the screen. So you know what speed the cars are going. The ambulance is the fastest thing in the game. Whoa! Slippery ice. Making up a blockade. Oh, you bastards. Crash. Game I didn't over. make it. You didn't make it. Pathetic. I made it through the first round. Got to try again. I'm playing Another novice, round. though. Yeah, novice. Or episode. I'm playing standard. Yeah. yeah. Look at this cat. Look at you. What Play are you one doing? One more in standard. Purring away. Such a happy kitty. He is a happy Aww. kitty. He got a nice dose of catnip. He's a very happy cat. Rewarded for being bad. Oh, he's always rewarded for being <laughs> bad. Yes, he is. Cats don't understand the word good. Nope. They only know bad. Yeah. They only know yeah. what they have access to and what they don't have access to. <laughs> they don't understand bad or good. No. Well, they do, and they want to yeah, do the bad things. Because they think that's fun. Yeah. Around this turn, you want to kind of maintain the cards yeah. on the screen because yeah, very they will crash into you from behind and in yes. front. Yeah. And that's right. You smash those cards. Yeah. <laughs> Ambulance, Ambulance. Just smash through them. Yeah. I play Turbo Arcade on Harmony Cart. They have to update the Harmony Cart. Oh, the Toko. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Dan ABC. They have to? We do. You're talking about us? They have to update the Harmony Cart. Yeah, because I'm using a special version of the Harmony Cart right now. <laughs> um, so there's going to be a new hardware version of the Harmony Cart being put out that'll support the Turbo. Damn it. <laughs> that'll support this game because I'm using I'm using beta mm -hmm. hardware um, to play this game. I can't remember what the... I think I did it because I heard a beep, beep, beep. As long as I don't die. Yeah.
Oops, I didn't have the pedal. I think we tried this with the pedal one day. And uh, <laughs> I didn't like it as much as the button. Mm -hmm. Not as easy. The button's fine. For yeah, games the, button, have, the button, yeah. For More games control. that have two controls might be better for the, the foot pedal. God damn it! Yeah. Oh. Oh yeah, you have cars now. RC70, the hill effect is so good. I can't even imagine how the camels do it. I love the hill. How they disappear and reappear yep. coming over the hill is amazing. Uh, did Atari finally calm down from the kitty uppers? Yeah. Yep. He's, he's crashed now. Yeah. Just like me. In the game. <laughs> crashed. Aww. Yeah. It's my last crashed? life. You've crashed. In the first round, you get unlimited lives. Yeah. After the first round, you get actual cars. Mm. Oh, oh, the bridge. Oh, I love the bridge, that bridge is awesome. Yeah. Just made it to the bridge. The square bridge, yeah. So. There is Turbo. It mm -hmm. is super cool. Highly recommended. Like all of these games, they're amazing. All of them are amazing in their own unique way. Like, Atari so good. Plus. So here is my Ready. colors for my Uno card. Uno card. So it's on build 17. Is that an old one? I haven't been keeping track. Who said, who said? I have an old Harmony version. Cart. Someone said update the Harmony Cart. I don't know. No, no, no. Somebody said your colors are wrong. Is it mm. Ivory Tower Collections? Because that would be why they're wrong. Yeah. I said the colors are wrong. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. this are the colors. What do I do? Yeah. <laughs> and how do I change the colors? Yeah. Is it the version? Is there a newer version than 17? Because that's the build. That's what the build says. Number 17. So, I don't know. I'll check after and see if I need to update it. <laughs> yeah, maybe that's it. RGB has changed it to PAL. Oh, when you start it up. Interesting. Really? Mm. Uh oh. I'm going to be pressing buttons here. Is that the right color? Is that the right color? Is that the right color? <laughs> I'm scared now. That I don't have the right... You're back to green. I know. But you were at blue before. Which one is it? Can you yes. which color? <laughs> yes, thanks. That's PAL. So it must be the blue. Green. That, that's the one I was originally That right? was you. That's what you were at. That one's proper? Is that the blue? That's PAL. Yeah, that, There's it's always a helpful. delay in the, in the chat, unfortunately. One more. Game of the Bear is also is my jam. Blue, yes, Game of the Bear is great. Blue and green and gray. Is it this one? I have to describe the colors. <laughs> Don't say that one. There's a huge delay. <laughs> it's like 10, to, 10 seconds to a minute of delay. We have no idea. That means my system's been on the wrong colors for not just the Uno, but for everything. For Harmony as well. One more. Oh my god, what a delay. This color. Like cyan. Green and green blue. And kind of I feel like that's uh C sixty four um blue and that's, cyan, yeah. Yeah. That looks more that looks right. Okay, so let's Thank you, Ivory Tower. In the harmony card then. <laughs> and see what colors that is. No, no. said C. I, I got to play Game of the Bear on this. Tuesday. Look at this. Look at these colors. That's, I love the purple. You've got to keep colors? the purple. No, that's the right color. <gasps> that purple is great. No. This is totally wrong. <laughs> I love the purple. Keep it. Now it's all screwed up. Turn on color cycle. Ivory Tower. <laughs> looks like looks insane. It's amazing. Looks insane. That does look cool. Yes, it's bar bar wrong. Generator. Go to the color bar generator. I know. No way this purple, is purple, right. Purple, purple, purple. Keep no it. no way this is right. I like purple. <laughs> that looks weird. <laughs> look What's <that>. blue? <gasps> look at this. this look is, at it. This is not right. This is, <laughs> this is, this is like a uh, C-cam or something. <laughs> I love it. This is my jam, by the way. What are these colors? This is so great. <laughs> Not this one? 
That's pal. That's pal. <laughs> Nazi camp because they're shades. <sighs> that's the right one. Yeah, that's it there. Or that one. Not that one. Not that one. Not that one. So that one. It's either this one, number one, or number two. This is a little bit brighter. Oh, I feel like I'm at the eye doctor now. Number one, number two. Number one, number the two. The color bar generator. At R E Fox Plus. Ready. Do I have that? Number one, Splendid Nut says. Number Colored one. Colored utility? Colored utility using... What is that? Oh, why does it change? Oh, color bar generator. There, oh, it's in a zip file. Oh, okay. Let's fix that. Because he really wants the color bar generator. One with yellow as the second color is NTSC colors. Hmm. Good night, S. Ramirez. Thank you Good night, for joining. S. Ramirez. Oh, yeah. Careful, all those uh, in the path of the winter storm. Oh, boy. Yeah. We had our winter storm earlier in the year. So on the on the Pacific coast, on the, those on the east, be very careful. Sea cam is a myth like dragons and elves, says VHC. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I have that in the zip file. I guess I've never used it. At Ari Fox Plus. Ready. Would be nice if this put it in alphabetical order, but that's a bit much for a poor little thing to do. Oh my god. And what I was trying to tell you before is that the RGB board will auto detect the game and palettes. Really? Oh wow. Nostalgic. Oh my god, this is a nightmare of sound. Okay, no, no. <laughs> What's fake gravity? I had the same question in my head. Ah! <laughs> Change the difficulty, every tower says. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> Good times. <laughs> okay, these are a bunch of colors. Which should I go to? Oh, nice. Oh, circle, lines. Which one should Dots. I go to? This one? Oh, test pattern. Woo! That's probably the one you want, right? Yeah. Had to mute for that part. <laughs> Sorry, everyone. R.I.P. Headphone users. This. 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 That's it. Well, that was brighter. That's not correct. Bottom left's Not the first color. One? Second one. Second one. One more. There you go. That yeah, one? that's bright. Yeah. That's got to be right. Stop. Stop. <laughs> Cycle slowly. No, it's it, this is not the best way to troubleshoot color. No, it isn't. <laughs> you need to do it over a Zoom or something. Yeah, I think so. Is this the right one? Delay in the chat is huge. One more. No, no, wait, wait. I've been on this one for like 30 seconds. <sighs> one more from this? That one. This one where it's a bit more muted. <laughs> Terrible. So slow. Chat. That one? Okay. Let's see the harmony. All right. At R.E. Fox Plus. That's the yep. one I was always on. I'm pretty Ready. sure that's what it was. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's all good. Just, oh, I want the purple back. It's just the, the Uno purple cart. Back. Oh, the purple was great. I think he's saying the Uno cart <laughs> automatically changes it, or the RGB. At RE Fox Plus. That's the same as before. Already. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, we're done. <laughs> so went through all that, and it went back to exactly what it was. <laughs> Fun stuff. Very fun. Sorry for this terrible high pitched screaming sound. <laughs> Everyone went, ah! ah. <laughs> Just load Zippy and see what color the porcupine <laughs> right, is. True. No, it's all fine now. Yeah.
Maybe he has a pal jumper on. Oh, I bet I do actually. There's like a 99% chance I have the pal jumper on. Yep, I do. Oh, there you go. For reasons. Um, I have that on. Okay, so um, where's my, what am I doing here? We are looking at what is coming up on the show. Coming up on the show is next episode. We're going to be moving into 7,800. So we're going to have to change the sign. I don't know if anybody recognized oh, that we had 2,600 up there. And we have to change it to 7,800. There you go. Ooh, fancy. Bye-bye, 2,600. Yeah, we'll be playing 7,800 uh, completed original and mm -hmm. ports next show. Um, and then the one after that, we'll be playing 7,800 work in progress original and ports. And then the next show after that, which is the last show before the awards, which is on a special day. It's going to be on Sunday, mm -hmm. not the awards, but the... Um, uh, the last show before the awards. We're going to be playing 8-Bit, 5200, and Lynx games, plus taking a look at the packaging mm. of all the games. I love packaging. Packaging. Yay. Reasons. Satisfactory. <laughs> no further questions. For reasons. Yeah. Uh, it was for testing a certain game that only runs on the Uno card. I think oh, it was I using see. Ace hardware. And I had to load it specifically directly Mm -hmm. onto onto the cart so it loaded up automatically without going through the menu. I think it was something like that. Um, and then we have the Atari Homebrew Awards live presentation at noon on February 12th. And we're going to have Darcy here. We're going to have Tanya. We're going to have special helpers. Yes. We've got two special helpers so far. Yep. Which are just barely enough. I'm hoping to get a third okay. special helper. So we'll special see. helpers can also, uh, you know, say hi. And... When will Tanya broadcast an after dark and how to create those yes, fantastic I will. Atari stuff? I will. Um, we'll have to make her own channel and do, a, do, <laughs> I do all have, of her own tech. I do have a login. Uh, no, I will not be doing all my own tech. Uh, yes, this is uh, one of the coasters I've done. I'm just having fun with it. Yeah. Really. I mean, I could create an Etsy store, but that just sounds like a hell of a lot of work. Yeah. Uh, did you show it up close? We showed it last episode. I know. I Said know. PH Craft. It's going to be blurry. Yeah. It's not autofocus. Oh, it's not? Oh, damn it. It's going to be like... Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, you can't really see. That's fine. <laughs> you can go to the cat yeah. cam if you want to really show no, it. No, no, no. It's okay. fine. We showed it last one. Yeah. Um, yeah. I like sparkly things. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. Erlen <gasps> might appear. No, not your thing. No, no, I know. He might. We'll I don't know. We'll see. Yep. We'll see if he does. Yeah. Uh, if he does, it, it probably wouldn't be on camera because he hasn't been here playing the games. No, but. he might just wave and say hi. He might help out. But We'll see. Yeah. Because he did last year. Yes, he did. Hopefully. Yeah. Um, what else? Oh, and then after that, when we return from a short break, we'll be back on March 4th. We're going to be playing Ruby Q exclusive. Fi oh, you guys can't see that. Exclusive <laughs> yeah. final build of Ruby Q. There's the other things. Mm. You can see the um, all the shows that are coming up and links to old shows where you can watch old shows. Um, uh, and thank you for watching Canadian Tenor. Um, we love playing all these games. It's so much fun. So much fun. And talking about new things and cool things and uh, flipping through PAL and NPSC <laughs> and piercing your ears. Yeah. Yeah. Looking at test patterns. It's great. Yeah. yeah. It's fun times. Yeah. Uh, you got to do it once in a while. Yeah. <laughs> well, we do it at the end of the show. Yeah. Uh, what else? That's it. I'm so excited oh, and happy to be here. And I bought uh, a Jaguar sure. multi-cart today. <gasps> oh, did you? And yes. do you have a Jaguar? I don't. Yeah. So I can look at it and just <laughs> stare at this multi-cart. That's right. Um, so I'll be able to load up any Jaguar game. To the Jaguar you don't have. <laughs> to the Jaguar I don't have. But but you are likely to have a Jaguar soon. There's a possibility. Somebody okay. has... Um, Offered to lend you one, right? Lend me... That's good. A Jaguar indefinitely until I buy one. Yes. Which is super awesome. I've got all the accessories already for it. Perfect. And you have games. 
and I have some games. Yeah. And we'll get some more games for Atari Day, Atari Age Day, which is uh, coming up at some point. Nice. Uh, March ish, mm. early, middle, late, mm. maybe April. Don't know. Okay. Whenever the games get here. <laughs> yeah. Whenever they're all the pieces come together. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that'll be a lot of fun. Thank you, Dan WC. Thank you, Atari 2600 Do, for watching. Mm -hmm. It's on my bucket list to get the Jaguar drive. Yeah. Um, Al just posted a bunch today. Uh, new ones, yeah. new uh, new batch released. They're not inexpensive, but neither is the Jaguar. So if you're all about that habit, let's see if there's still some left. Um, Jaguar um, books and games hardware uh, game drive. Uh, yeah, so still some left. I don't know if any of you guys care about Jaguar, but because we never played on the show. But uh, there's a Jaguar drive that I just bought. I didn't get the box and larger manual because I don't care about a box for a multi heart. I'm sure it looks really, really cool. Yeah, it's a cool box. So, yeah, you put in the SD card and you can play Homebrew. That's awesome. That hasn't been so. I like to, I like to have multi cards for all the systems. Yeah. Because then you can play anything. Anything. Yeah. Works in progress, old games. Games you download off Steam and then convert. That's and right. Then, yeah. That's right. Mm -hmm. uh, and this emulates Jaguar CDs as well. So you don't oh, cool. even need that <gasps> add on expensive really? oh, okay. CD drive. Nice. Yep. It gives you all the options. Everything. I think that's amazing about the multi carts. Somebody that are just out there. asked just before. So yeah. <laughs> my stream will catch up to you and you'll find out the answer right now. Um, <laughs> yes. Atari Jaguar without Jaguar CD installed. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um, and it does play Jaguar CD. Does it say this? Somebody did answer. Uh, Al, Al answered somebody and says, yes, it plays Jaguar CD That's games. That's awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, so it plays everything you need. Mm -hmm. So that's exciting. Due to limited availability, please only a single order, single Jaguar game drive. <laughs> um, so they are available at this very second during the live broadcast. Oof. If you're watching this on YouTube, yep. they're probably gone because he did imply that there's very, very small amounts mm. of them. And this is, uh, I believe, made by Saint, uh, the same person who was working on the 7800 game oh. drive. Oh, same cool. name. Okay, very cool. Yep. Yep. Super uh, awesome. RC78 says, are you sure you're not getting a big cat instead of console? Well, if I do, it's worth a lot more than a Jaguar. Yeah, so probably. <laughs> I could buy many Jaguars for the Jaguar. Mm. I just have to give, send it Trade to it? A, a zoo or... I don't know. Let it loose in the wild, mm -hmm. wherever they come from. Where do jaguars? South I, America? I Africa? I have no idea where jaguars are from. South Asia? No. I don't, I don't know. know. I don't know where, like... Yeah, let's I don't know. see where jaguars come from. <laughs> what part of the world do jaguars come from? Oh, there we go. They are in Mexico and South America. Oh, I see... Uh, Colombia, ex extreme Brazil. southern Arizona, New Mexico, <laughs> Mexico, Central America, Arizona. Amazon. Wow! Yeah, I didn't ran know into that. A jaguar, Paraguay, and northern Argentina. So there's the hot spot, Manhattan, I think. Manhattan, yeah, mm, South mm, America. Mm. Um, I'm quite surprised by oh, southern Arizona. Current and former. Okay. Oh, so. it's former range of Southern Arizona. Right. Okay, that makes more sense. Mexico yeah. and South America. Okay. okay. Yeah. Fair enough. Fair and enough. And you're related to them. Yes, you are. He's, <laughs> he's a tiny jaguar. Yeah, he is. Maine Coon. <laughs> I would love a Maine Coon. They're so cute. Yes. You want a fluffy Maine Coon kitten? Atari? Would yeah. you put up with a Maine Coon kitten? Big big big. Do you want Maine a Coon? kitten? Would you smother it? I don't know. <laughs> would you bite it? Would you eat it? No, he's a sweet cat. <laughs> I don't think he would. He would play with it. He would play with a cat. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so we <laughs> are done yes. till Tuesday. Yes. So thank you for watching, everyone, including the people who s stayed till the very end. Who are? Splendid Nut, Carl G, BR Pocock, Atari 2600 Dude, RC70. Dan ABC, Ivory Tower Collections, who said he was able to uh, watch the show because he was all caught up in his projects. Oh, excellent. Canadian Tenor, Vitoko. Um, um, 
Nostalgic 26. S. Ramirez. Yep. Um, the Age Dead Sea. Yeah. We played your game oh, very, very early. I don't know so if cool. you watched it. I went further than I've ever been. Yes, but you did I died really well on in Canonica. Second yeah. boss -ish. You did. You boss. did really well. Really well. I feel like I got a good run on Game of the Bear too. You did. Which yeah. was the first time ever playing it on Tuesday. So moist pug. Yes, a, new, a new name. Yeah, yeah. new name. They Thank you for they watching. chatted for the first time. Yeah. Always, always um, like that. Who uh, else? Mike Soul, Old yep. Style, uh, Miss old Command, style. and that is the top. Yes, thank so, you. So thank you everybody for tuning in. Yes. We will be back uh, on Tuesday, mm -hmm. regular time, is the same as tonight, mm -hmm. um, with more nominated games. Next time it's seventy eight hundred yeah. games. Mm -hmm. We're moving on to the other beast over there mm -hmm. uh yeah you have a good weekend too mm -hmm. everybody have a good weekend and stay safe and uh stay stay healthy and stay healthy. well and yeah and hug your cats you hug your cats yeah yes isn't that right atari even yeah. when he's bad All so right. <laughs> we'll see you next time see you on tuesday yep. bye bye everyone bye.